Y'all know what it is, man. We back again. Another episode of R.E.O.P. We out here gambling with our lives. Man. Man, you're right. You right. You're right. You're right. You're right. I don't know what this man is talking about. I am not doing that. Oh, man. I messed it up. You good. I can edit it up. But there we go. Edit all that shit up. Yeah. <laughs> Missing his legs next week. You want to see that? <laughs> nah, bro. When they be like, where do you live? I'm going to give them your address. Come on, man. I mean, that's how I do. They gonna yeah. cut my legs off, dog. Nah, they ain't gonna Don't cut, let them cut my legs off, dog. He already done had the cop. Oh, you talking about the your Russians? You what remember, was what was that first thing he was about to say? You remember that time he had the, the cops had uh, the SWAT team had arrested him on his birthday? Oh, <laughs> no, yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> that was a great birthday present. A great birthday present. I forgot birthday I got arrested present. on my birthday. Thanks for reminding me. This thank you speed. I, bro, oh God, I didn't want to get arrested on my birthday. If that helps. I don't think none of us do, bro. Nobody do. I don't think, I don't think, I don't think I nobody want to get arrested on their birthday. Bro. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Dang, I done hit it again. You gonna have you gonna have a lot of edit in this first show. I ain't gonna edit. Oh, <laughs> we're gonna dock it from your pay. We're what? random acts of podcast. We don't edit. Shit. We just uh, let it float. Uh, oh yeah, there there, there, there goes that. <laughs> we got a special guest in the building, man. Yeah. Man, go ahead and introduce yourself, man. Be hey, dog. Hey, yeah, because they know who we is. Hey, I understand. Thank you guys for having me on the pod, by the way. I said, my name's Connor Overbay. I am from the Who Are You podcast here in Jacksville. I'm sure you guys may have seen a couple of your hosts on my podcast yeah. in the past. You can check us out. It's going to be at Who Are You Pod from everything from Instagram, all the social media. You guys know where to find me at nowadays yeah. and on YouTube. But yeah, uh, yeah, yeah man. You ain't have what? Devin or Devin Band for your what's podcast. Your, what's your name again? My name's Connor. That's, what's your last name? Overbay. That is the whitest. Goddamn name! It is I've a white ever name. Heard hey. It is a white name. <laughs> it's okay. It's <laughs> not. That's a good thing. Like we got some nigga names, but that, that's well, the y'all, white. I got, name. I got a good. I got a Joseph Jefferson. You my know name, what I'm saying? Yeah. I call in. My name. They Kevin don't Williams. know. What? I name. mean, they know you black. They don't know I'm black. True. Until Go either way. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, my name Anthony Green. Bro. They know you black. They know ain't you. Ain't no black. white Anthony Green. I checked. No it Anthony ain't Green. none. Bro. It's literally I've a dude. Never met an it's Anthony a dude Green. that made music named Anthony Green. That's what that white. Hold really? on, let me pull him up. Pull uh-huh. him up. You know him? You sure he nah, was like how I'm talking about it with you. <laughs> nah, you said you were talking about the Don't Star. The, the white I'm name. just saying he might be black. <laughs> for all you know. <laughs> uh, Anthony Green. Let me see. Wow, that man is white as fuck. Anthony Green. He like, he's, damn, he's on a see through over man. there. He like, he That's played, a pseudo name, bro. He's like an extra on Grey's Anatomy. I don't know what kind of music this is. <laughs> Not good. Music. He makes skunk, I never heard he of makes skunk music. What the what hell? What the fuck yeah, is that? That's, that's, oh, that's music to get skunks in the mood. It's a it's it's, it's a recent thing. Skunks in the mood. Yeah, yeah you got to breed skunks. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. You've been hanging out with them boys. I've been hanging out with too many of them boys, actually. <laughs> oh, yeah, but that's a, he's a skunk breeder. That makes sense. Skunk yeah, breeder. You got a yeah. Wikipedia. I don't. So. You ain't wrong. Not yet. Just can't find my can ass make, out there yet. Yeah, we can whip y'all up. Where, you know, I'm going to be honest. This, motiv- this motivated me because I like I got to be the most famous Anthony Green. So I mean, yeah. Starting tomorrow, I'm yeah. on it. You got to take that nigga out. First. I got to be more famous than him. Yeah, you got to take that nigga out first. And then but what I you going to do, him. bro? You can only be one. You can only be one. I'm you gotta be him. like you I'm gotta be like Shiggy. I'm gonna kill him with success. You gotta be like Shiggy, bro. Okay, go. okay go to go to peaceful. Like ground, Shiggy. I, guess. I mean, yeah, yeah, you gotta start dancing. <laughs> <laughs> You start dancing, nigga. I post this shit everywhere. I post it at my church. I, I post it at the farmer's market right now on Beaver I'm Street. You, bro, I post the, it everywhere. That's the that's the golden goose, bro. I've never seen Amp dance. And if, you know, this is time for him to do I've known this man, what, 16, 17 years now? Damn near 20 years? I don't know. This shit, how old are we now? I don't yeah, know. No it's got to be 20 years. Yeah, yeah. Right. I've never seen that man years. dance. Old, you you from Jax, right, Devin? Yeah, I'm from Jax. Where'd you go to high school at? Wilson. Wilson. Okay. I'm pointing at you. I was, like I'm that. a Sandalwood boy. Like that. I'm pointing at y'all like that, nigga. You a Sandalwood boy? Yes, y'all, y'all won the ops. I ops was Inglewood. Oh, yeah. I Still mean, is. Inglewood's everybody's ops, yes. though, bro. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah. To be yeah. honest with yeah, it. Sandalwood, we used to fuck all y'all bitches. They weren't good looking, so I mean, <laughs> <laughs> we, didn't, yeah, we did not say that. Yeah, we didn't say you, they you was good looking. If you want. Yeah, they we were said, available. We just said they, we just took them. We didn't yeah. say they were, yeah. they were good. Easy, easy picking. Nah, they, <laughs> they like the tall white boys over there. I would say, me being one of the only ones walking around Sandalwood. But, you know, that was back back Bad then. Witches. Huh? Yeah. <laughs> witches. They were like, take me to a better life. Oh, man, that's <laughs> crazy. <laughs> he, he in high school, but I know he got good credit. <laughs> take me to a better life. That's hate. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> Yo, that would be like my game moving forward. Like, bitch, you ain't hurt. Yeah, <laughs> I, I take bitches to the promise land. Like, yeah, you, ain't gotta do, you ain't gotta keep doing all this hood shit, baby. I got you. You ain't gotta go to Africa. Whoa, whoa. I was just saying. My game, my game. That's why God ain't make me white. You know what I mean? My game will be ridiculous. <laughs> like, Your game will be racist. Hey, 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 call it what it is. Oh. You don't have to go to Dubai. Sam, it's insane. We, let's unite. <laughs> Bro, that's crazy. Yeah, don't, don't, he was dancing to that Trump song. All right, was, chill out, chill out. Chill out. The, the, the Mexican one, right? He was dancing to the Mexican Trump song. Hey. That's not a good one. Because he Bro, tried, to get, he tried to get them though. niggas out of here. So that's not hard, though. He's definitely trying to get them out of here. Yeah, he, he, he mad they made that song, but he got to let because of that song. Shit, they it's, voted. Shit, I saw the polls. It's a, it's a weird conundrum. Uh, What's y'all's opinion on that whole situation? I, I mean, at the end of the day, what can we do if they if they decide to be like you know what I'm gonna rent rent higher for these boys what what are we gonna do bro you know what I mean dog I don't know how they did it but they planned January six they said I thought they said they planned January six no 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 they did oh you mean they like, did. no 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 I'm saying that happened right yeah. We just got a plan to revolt. Like we need to overthrow the government at some point. I saw the movie mm. Civil War like, this year. And, no, um, I don't know about that. That's what I'm hey, bro. Now look, look. They I ain't got, saying them boys got cooked January six. We need yeah yeah yeah. What? They <laughs> found they, they, they found all them motherfuckers yeah, after January six. See, our problem is our problem is we can't unite. You know what I mean? We got to unite the fight. But they got nuclear weapons. We. That's my whole thing, bro. The guns they got, they got make our little pistols look like nothing. Guns. True indeed. I don't, we don't have True big indeed. guns. We got big guns. We got big guns. Like, I ain't got no 50 cows. I know y'all niggas seen SWAT. Around. Nigga, with Shamar hey, bro, Moore. They lit that block up. With Shamar Moore? Yeah, bro. Yeah, not, they, not the TV show, nigga. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> you watch the same? Boy, LL Cool J. I know you ain't watching that the, shit. The, the that boy, LL Cool J. I couldn't wait to talk about that show. <laughs> With Shamar Moore? Yeah, yeah. Uh, nigga, yes. I'm watching I, I that thought, now. I, I thought we what were episode doing you all? I thought we were doing the thing. You got excited, bro. So, so the one with LL Cool J. Yes. That's crazy. Yeah, it's going to be different on, on this end because Trump, he's still mad that on January 6th, they got his people up out of here. <laughs> so he's going he gonna to use lethal force. Yeah, yeah. He's yeah. trying to revolt on him. He's going to yeah. use all yeah, kinds of bombs. If he see too many, if he, if, if he see any niggas in the crowd, he gonna, he gonna mm. use lethal force. Man. It don't even, yeah. it don't even gotta be black people. It just gotta it's be good. poor people. If he yeah, smell, well, if he smell poor people, yeah. I mean, it was, he gonna, he, he's killing. He doesn't smell like you know, he poor my, people. He January six, but it oh, was, it but was, that, that, that's his poor people. Yeah, yeah, it's gotta yeah. be like uh, Mexicans or you know what I mean. Yeah. People of some kind of color. That fella don't sound, don't smell like he in my tax bracket often. Yeah. <laughs> I mean. I I say if you're in his tax bracket, bro, that's a whole different world. Man. <laughs> I say I don't got that many millions in my bank account. <laughs> Shit, I went, don't got one. I wish I did. Like I know a lot of people disappointed the election, but I'm like, do we not know this is the way it was gonna go? Like you really thought uh, Mala was gonna win, bro? <clears throat> I had some hope, bro. That nigga was dropping seventy on her the first round, bro. Like I, I had no hope. So Sam makes some good points in the Discord. He made some in uh, in the Discord earlier, right? He Sam, was, um, the fucking. Hey, boy, Sam. Hey, but my okay. Whoa, that's crazy. Whoa, I gotta edit that. <laughs> that's out. That's crazy. crazy. <laughs> I'm gonna say, <laughs> crazy. I didn't say I didn't stop say repeating it. If you just happen to have, <laughs> if you just happen to have, happen to have uh, weapons of mass and destruction and in his garage, Sam is clearly black. Also, you just got some racist shit. I'm just nah, Sam, not all the way black, bro. Say what you gotta say, Joe. That's ignorant. Yeah, <laughs> Kamala was losing the first time she ran against Joe Biden. You know yeah, what I mean? Yeah, I remember that. To be the front runner, like she really didn't do enough during his presidency to be viewed as like that front runner. Now, you know what I mean? As far as like I would say the general public goes, right? Trump is familiar, if nothing else. A lot of people voted, I would say, for Trump just because of that alone. If they had to choose between Trump and Kamala, who over the last four years, on a social level, you can't name one thing she fucking did for us. Besides raise the prices of everything. One initiative, you know, anything. So in that regard, I think that people voted what was comfortable. You know what I mean? And yeah. Trump ended up winning because Trump is a hell of a salesman. Marketing, oh, yeah, like, yo, 
people get away with a lot of things in our face because they have the money to stay in our face. You know what I'm saying? Bro, him him being indicted and him getting shot, I, I keep telling people that helped in the election. I like Kamala should have got her ass shot. Mark Wahlberg's still doing blockbuster movies. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Major racist is- incident. You know what I'm saying? Like yeah. that that blew up. You oh, know I what remember. <laughs> um, I'm well aware. <laughs> um, what, um, what Mark Wahlberg did? Yeah, he, uh, he tell me some real shit. He was beating up like Asians and yeah. Yeah. calling them slurs and what? Like, all throughout yeah. high school. Ooh, shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. When he was Funky Mark and, and I know, Mark, yeah, Marky Mark and the Funky Bunch. Yeah, yeah, I didn't like my ass didn't even hear about that yeah, whole situation was, back in the doing, day. He was doing let's, Asian let's be honest, beat downs. Connor, uh, look at your shirt. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I say that's about that's about look. That's about look. Yeah, 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 yeah. And you're white. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. I and mean, all the shirts yeah, to wear no. on the podcast today. Yeah, in Boston they do stuff like this. <laughs> yeah. I mean, my whole family from Boston, Philly, all that, all yeah. those areas, man. Don't take us. It's but not, no, I'm not hey, hey. <laughs> But I was born and raised here in Jax. <laughs> right. uh, I was a whole right. different demographic. Yeah, you're, sure. just, you're, just, you're just a fan. It's yeah. nothing wrong with being a fan. It's nothing wrong with being a fan. Nah, it's funny, man. Um. But yeah, uh, I think that overall, you know, Kamala didn't have a ch- I, I made the comment er- on the podcast. I think it was one of our bonus episodes. Is America really ready for a, 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 a woman president? Ain't even about America. Mm-hmm. It's about the countries that don't deal with women that she would have to deal with, too. Like Russia, Korea, yeah, all that place. Yeah, seeing a woman in leadership, they're not going to want to fuck with her. I, I also think she Take fucked it. up in two, in two other areas as well. Like, I remember there was one clip where she was talking like at a rally and someone said, like, God is king. And she said, you're at the wrong rally. Damn. I, I, I saw that. I was like, ooh. She said it out loud? She said it out loud in the, in the rally. No, that's and, insane. And then yeah, she told she... them to go to the smaller rally down the, down the street. Oh. Dead oh. ass. Like I said, she said that. I was like, ooh. I was like, you fucked up there because Shit. yeah, I think let's say the country here, a lot of religious people. I'm not personally religious myself, but when she said that, I was like, ooh, it shows. <laughs> yeah, I was like, that was like, I was, that was an Damn aggressive one. And, and you gotta think, you gotta think too. Like she hit the ground running. I don't know if you mm-hmm. forgot, but she didn't start this. Uh, it wasn't her at first. It was Biden. So yeah. she really had to hit the ground running. She had to take that nigga notes plus some shit. She might have. Whipped up mm-hmm. and put together. I mean, like, the we same argument they were trying to use against um, Trump were were the complaints people had about Kamala. Mm. Was that hey, I don't, we don't, we don't know anything of your policy. We don't know what you're gonna do. You know what I'm yeah, saying? Right. And they were trying to say that about Trump. But again, it's one of those things to where he served four years. Yeah, you know she don't start. She didn't. She don't start shucking and jiving until it's an election year. And yeah. and 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 not even just that. She was doing a black like, boy. She was tap dancing. She threw salt oh, on I, the ground. I put, I put my greens in the tub, face ass. <laughs> I like, mean what? the lion, the excessive like pandering to yeah, that's, every that's, demographic. Yeah, that's, what, that's what Hillary was doing too, though. Mm-hmm. When yeah. she said, uh, "What's the hot sauce in her bag?" Mm-hmm. Yeah, and all that shit. My favorite. My favorite thing about this election, you know, when it was going around trying to get votes, when it first started was when um, she was uh, having a round table, I guess, or whatever, and she was asking people in the audience questions, like uh, regular Americans' questions, and it was like, um, you said, you mentioned something about the food prices going down, and like, you're going you're gonna to fix that when you run. Why don't you do that now? She, and she didn't know what to say, bro. Like I'm, I felt, I felt what bro was saying. It was too like many you're literally in the like office. T- yeah, you're literally in the office right now. Why are you fixing this shit now? Why that, you gotta fix it when you get if you get elected? That was another thing she said as well. Like I think they asked her on the um, one of the one another time they did like a, a video thing with her, and she's like, "Do you agree?" Or they the person asked her like, "Do you agree with everything Biden done or did?" And would you change anything? And she said, "No." I was like. But that's her fallen <laughs> party line, right, you know. Right. I mean, like she she has to say yeah. that kind of thing. So I understand somewhat of that. But I was like, that might be another thing that kind of fucked everything up for the her as well. Yeah, these last four years, I can't think of a damn thing she's done for anybody. Not even not just black people, not just you know women. What has she done? What has that well, whole usually, whole party done? Well, usually your first four years is like bullshit anyway. First mm-hmm. four years is just fixing what the other president did. Yeah, but Trump. what did he? What did what did Biden fix? Name one thing. I'm gonna be honest. I think Biden was in there buying time. For Biden was a placemaker. 
more than anything. <clears throat> Man, I done but, told y'all, man, Joe Biden died two years ago, man. Shut that, up, that's see? a that's an animatronic. Shut up. I don't, I don't like, disagree. I might up. be some shit, bro. He's he dead. He <laughs> dead, yeah, bro. He looks, shut he, up. He looks different every time you see him yeah, on screen. Call, he call, look, he looks tired. tired. They call him. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> you yeah, ever seen Jim Henson? Cheese. Jim Henson the Muppet. <laughs> they call him Jim Henson people. The same people that did the the body work on the on the Ninja Turtles movie. They did the Joe Biden. <laughs> so why they ain't got him more comprehensive <laughs> or more shiny? There's somebody with, no with a spots. string holding, bro. Why that's people, funny. And y'all know white people don't age well. He was fucked up. He don't. He like he looked fucked he's up probably, every time. He's probably really somebody only that hit his ass with the death note. All right, <laughs> <laughs> I'm just saying yeah, yeah, they, that man deteriorated. Bro, they had tweeted that they, incoherent. They tweeted. Joe they Biden. said Joe Biden went to bed 9:30. <laughs> <Damn. laughs> oh, why are you tweeting that? The, co- the country don't stop running, bro. The country 24 hours. Bro, dead, bro. <laughs> that's why I'm doing podcasts and shit. God damn, you go to bed at 9:30. Right, that's insane. I think what Sleepy they Joe. thought was Democrats thought that <laughs> Joe Biden would win. That would buy them four years to build a solid. Honestly, uh, honestly, I feel like if he was still running and he wasn't so damn tired all the time, he probably would have won again. No. I think he would have. No. Niggas Why hated not? Joe Biden's term. Niggas hated Joe. Niggas didn't know who Joe Biden was the first time he won. So, like, what would be the, the first time now? he won? What the fuck are you talking about? When he won presidency the first time? I mean, I mean he was going for a second term. Did? He was a uh, vice president to Obama, wasn't he? Yeah. 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 They was yeah. best friends. No, That's but they were, they were they were begging Joe Biden to run for president. Yeah, that's you remember, what I'm saying. Like, you remember the first time he didn't want to run because they yeah. wanted him. They want him to run against Trump the first time, and we got Hillary. They were like begging Joe Biden to run. He was like, "Hell no!" Nah. I think he was run, he didn't run because <laughs> his son was on crack. Also, that nigga. Like that. Also, <laughs> also, also, he was already old. The, as the fuck. other son was dying at that time, if I ain't mistaken. And oh. you know, the other son had that court case. Yeah, well, he the did. Laptop. I didn't want to bring up the yeah, son that died, laptop. but yeah, he had a he had a crack son in there. That son yeah, that was dying. Yeah, I mean, he had his crack on, son was doing his, it all throughout his, his fucking term. He was really very on true. crack. I yeah, mean, yeah, like he was true. on yeah. advanced crack at that yeah. time. Yeah, he was that getting on crack, bro. Them videos was fucking crazy. You remember they found like <laughs> coke in the White House and shit too? Yeah. They found like a baggie. I was yeah. like, like, I want to be like, man, that was Obama's. That went. Damn, I, I would have been. I would have grabbed anyone that in a was suit. Obama crack. <laughs> I would have grabbed anyone crack. in a suit next to me and be like, "Is this nigga? <laughs> is this nigga cocaine?" You right, better like, say that, like, crack. Like, bro. Like you mean they ain't got nobody in the White House? When the White House doesn't oh, take the fall, kill you. like come on, somebody gonna take the fall in the White House. So Everyone's gonna take the fall. Like they bro. got a fall man in the White House, bro. Them niggas don't become whistleblowers till like five years after. Right. The shit. Like, mm-hmm. Let me tell you what he boy was doing. I y'all throw was everybody. Under the bus, I'd be on some Trump shit. Mm. I mean, y'all hear about that shit with like Boeing, right? The planes. Mm-hmm. You guys hear about all that? I literally have flown on Boeing planes before. I think we all have on yeah. most planes that like, you go like going out the airport and everything. Mm, big motherfuckers. So Boeing's been having an issue where there's like screws that keep the plane together. And oh, do you yeah. guys remember that story of the plane like door like opened up while people are flying in there yeah. and everything? I was just talking about that recently. Yeah, uh, one of the whistleblowers <laughs> randomly was found in his car dead with a bullet uh, bullet wound in his head. I'm oh, like, oh shit. I'm like, yeah, yeah, yeah. And, and just I, re- I feel like that happens all the time. I bet it yeah, does, and we just don't hear about it. Right, right. It After definitely that, does. They had a, they had one of the wheels fall <coughs> off in Atlanta and land on somebody fucking land on a person. What? Well, this was a few Anytime months ago. Anytime you hear fuck? a major story, there's a whistleblower mm-hmm. and that shit dies. Hey man, well, if y'all want to get into <laughs> a conspiracy bag, go on Google. Look up the uh, Clinton family body count. Yes. It's a black dude. I can't remember his name. He was like, a, he was working with the, the Clintons. He was in a plane crash. The black box was gone, and bruh had a bullet hole in his head. And they can't explain why he had a bullet <laughs> hole in his head. And they can't explain why the bo- black box gone. And you know you can't destroy the black box on the plane. Yeah, yeah. There was another one of same with the Clintons, bro. It's one of their workers was found hung up in a tree yeah. with a shotgun blast on his chest, and the gun was like 30 feet away. So <laughs> homie's hanging from his neck, which would already kill you, and homie had a shotgun blast, and they called it suicide. Yeah. I was like, what? I heard That's about insane. the um, the uh, chef. Obama yeah. chef, right? Yeah. yeah. Oh, okay, yeah. Obama I didn't hear about chef. that. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so what happened? It, like one of the chefs had seen some shit or something, and he was finna come up. 
come out about it and the nigga ended up missing. You know what it was? They huh. see, he seen Michelle Obama dick because they say Michelle Obama <laughs> man. <laughs> What's going on, <laughs> you man? You talking about Big Mike? This one, you talking about Big Mike? Big Mike is crazy. Hey, y'all ever heard of Michelle Obama conspiracy? That I never did. He said he saw Big Mike. He saw Big Mike. What it was was he saw Michelle Obama. Bro, that could have went so many different. Hey, Michael Obama is hilarious. Nah, he saw a pen in one of the urinals Standing up. That nigga said he saw a dick. <laughs> and he'll follow it up with Big Mike gotta and the Lunas. You gotta get this nigga out of here. This might be the last much. episode, man. This gonna, be the, this gonna be the one that gets hey, up on I love you in case we in a business. You know what I'm saying? Man, you like, said that shit, man. If you ever find me in the car of the boot, we in my head. It was not me killing myself. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Like, all these cameras. Right. Like, it wasn't me. If you see a shotgun 10 feet away from me while I'm being home, that wasn't me to shot myself. Yeah. This is man, I used to work with a dude. I ain't gonna say bro name. He watched actually watched the podcast. He was heavy into like the conspiracy. Well, he was like, it wasn't the regular conspiracy. He was like into like the Rizza Islam ass conspiracy. Oh, that like, yeah, God, yeah, like yeah. bananas, the real bananas got seeds in them and yeah, shit like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's different though. Crazy. Every day when it was kind of work, man, he hey, showed me what shit like that though. All right. I'm just saying. <laughs> it don't take much to evolve like fruits and shit like that. You know what I mean? Oh, you think uh, grapes are man made? No, no, no. Joe on the special. Broccoli's man made. Broccoli's man made. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I've heard that since high school. I've also, people that. be saying tilapia man made. Tilapia is not man made. Tilapia, you get tilapia out there out the ocean. Not the ocean. A man made ocean, though. It not ain't an ocean, ocean you get tilapia. Out it's out a man made. They grow on like, a farm, bro. Yeah. yeah, you got it, but that's man control. It's not a real fish. They made that fish. Bro. Nah, bro. There's weird, there's all kinds of weird shit, man. Like even just yeah. think about it, like this is even conspiracy. Think about the shit they put in our food now. Like yeah. you got oh, they yeah. got uh, oh, yeah, they the got what's name Kennedy in there now, and they're talking about cleaning up the food and stuff. Bro. Oh, Kennedy that's some real shit. Crazy Kennedy, like, hey, shit, fuck a whistleblower, nigga. I'm about to I'm about <laughs> to uh, grab the the megaphone. Yeah, mm-hmm. don't. He'd be like one of these. Be like, don't ever eat grits. Be like. I don't eat grits like 20,000 times. Saying, what do you mean? I don't ever eat yeah, grits. Like, Kennedy be saying? scaring a nigga. Right. Have you ever grabbed a bowl of cereal? I'm dead. Like, I'm already I got dead. six in the cabinet now. <laughs> Y'all ever seen them, them um, Dr. Umar videos when he be like, black people spend $40 million a year on grits. Black people, if you give me 20% of your grit money, I can build this school. That's funny as hell. Oh, like nah, $40 million a year nigga. on grits is crazy. I'm sorry, but I'm yeah, not risking my grit money for of your grit money, money nigga. Yeah. I think we got different fees. I don't see that on my feed. Yeah. I'm, not, I'm not risking my grit money for Dr. Umar. I don't, I don't even know that nigga. Like, bro, I don't think we spend $40 million a year. Like, Waffle House might. <laughs> <laughs> right, but right, right. I ain't gonna hold you. I ain't never investing in none of them. Like I'm building a school funds. Yeah, you always find something crazy going. You ain't on going to that school. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Like, it's, your kid it's not. It's not school. many of them. It's like Bro, most. Shit. Most of the people can fund their schools. You don't see too many people like uh, all the celebs that got schools. They funded them. LeBron funded his just recently. LeBron, Jalen, yeah. Jalen Rose got a school yeah. in Detroit. Bro. I wouldn't go there. Oh, that's what's up. Most people. A lot of people well, that got yeah, school. Well, yeah, anybody that can fund it and ain't public about it. <laughs> it yeah. is Umar. It's some video. No, 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 shit. Even Donda, uh, yeah, he shit. Oh, I don't know. It was some funny shit going on over there. Well, they well, he say made, he was abusing that's a, nigga. That's a coat. He was doing what? He, they say he was abusing uh, the kids over there. He was beating the kids like, in the school? Oh, right. Nah, the oh. shit that shit throws me off, bro. Sounds about right. It's like, you, you guys know, like I used to work in pest control and everything, right? Yeah. And I would go take care of some of these local um, homeless shelters. And I would go talk to the head higher ups. They're making $1 million a year while yep. these people have rats running around their yep. building. And I'm like, what the oh, fuck? What sense does it make, right? Yeah. And then like I go in, there's holes. I go like three floors down, all this other stuff. I'm like... It's a, it's like a it's a lot of loopholes. You don't have to give them that whole money. Mm-hmm. Like you only can you only supposed to get like a certain percentage like, for a person who's just sitting up in an office and is basically ordering food and stuff. I'm like, you're yeah. making a mill. Like the fuck? How are like, you making that much money? Like, bro, them not my rats. <laughs> <laughs> you ain't wrong. Like, I'm not hating. Get your bag, but <laughs> still, it's just nah, like fuck that. I'm hating. Mm-hmm. Drop that bag, nigga. <laughs> I'm telling on y'all. Yeah, most of, oh, most definitely. But who would you go to? The oh, media, I mean, the media, I guess. I be talking about my Trump. podcast about that shit all the time, bro. I say, I see that shit, man. Trump would be like, give him more money. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Or they, or they, or they, they, they don't fuck with the million. Give him two million. Yeah. <laughs>
I'm gonna personally donate a million just for your pain oh, and suffering. Most definitely, most definitely. Nah, there was a whole thing. <clears throat> Did you guys hear about that whole uh, art grant that was happening in Jacks? Nah. There was a bunch. So there's a bunch of big artists in Jacksonville, and they're all talking about like how they're trying to do like local murals and all this stuff. And it got awarded to like people that no one knew about in the city. They're like, mm. where'd that money really go? Mm. That was a huge thing a couple of weeks ago. I was seeing that like a bunch of people I've had on the pod were talking about it, like artists and stuff. They're like, <laughs> like I've never heard this person in Jacksonville in my life, and they got 250k. I don't want to be that guy, but I feel like Condoleezza Rice. Is behind, I'm not Condoleezza Rice, but uh, Corrine Brown is behind that. Well, there's also <laughs> I can't been, trust that. Bitch. You be scamming. I can't trust that bitch. There's also been a big initiative of them trying to bring people in and, mm. and say that they're from Jax to use that money. Mm. So yeah, yeah, they're they're, they're they're definitely you know finagling. But some weird shit, man. You know, yeah. I'm in the wrong side. I ain't be in politics, bro. That's it. That's where all the money be at. Nah, we be dead is. in two seconds, bro. The shit, we just talked about second ago. They kill us. Nah, he gonna <laughs> edit like, it out. Yeah, I've been saying. <laughs> I've been saying some shit where uh, speaking of like grants and stuff. I seen one where they gave like a bunch of people like fifty k or some shit like that, for like what? photographers in Jacksonville. What? I was looking at that list. I was like, bro, what is this shit? Mm-hmm. I was like, bro, where the fuck y'all got all this money? It was like twenty people on the list. I was like, how you gave all the people fifty k a piece to take pictures? Yeah, what was the funding? Well, I mean, how much was the funding? I don't know, bro. Fifty k. Can everybody just got fifty? How many people? And you say it was twenty. Yeah, it looks like half 20. a million. It, it was a big list. Yeah, and each one of them people got twenty. Yeah. 20. That's crazy. I was like, bro, the fuck y'all getting that you, money? Out of twenty people, you heard them. None of them people. I served one person, but I ain't gonna say the homie. It's the homie. Damn. You know who I'm talking about. But, but yeah. they don't want to pay these podcasters. But I, I, was like, I was like, who is these other niggas though? And you don't. Know, yeah, you won't know who are these niggas. But you gotta go to Art Walk, bro. There might be an Art Walk. <laughs> All right, maybe at least ten of them. I haven't made my way to Art Walk Don't yet either. Don't make me say what I want to say. <laughs> <laughs> What's up with Art Walk? Freedom of speech, bro. They ain't take that right from you oh, yet. Ain't no wrong Art Walk. Yeah, Art Walk. No, Art Walk. Art Street. I ain't been in. I ain't been in a few years, but it's normally straight. <laughs> normally. Right. We 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 up at these niggas. We go to Art Basel now. We don't go, Art Basel. We don't go yeah. to that little, that little kid shit. No. <laughs> <laughs> nah, there's been all kinds of little places popping up, like co- I mean, collab and everything too. They've yeah, they yeah. gotten big from what I've been seeing. They for what? Sure, for sure. Collab. What's that? Uh, uh, it's, <laughs> it's like it's up the street here. It's like that way. It's another spot where you can go in. Like it's a, it's a lot to do with like fashion from what I've seen, right? Uh, fashion, yeah, industry, photography. photography. Yeah. 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 Mm-hmm. But they have like five, six different businesses, whether it's making clothes, doing like <clears throat> art shows, business, or not business, um, fashion shows and everything. They've really been kind of blowing up. And what I've been seeing, they've been kind of a little bit more spreading the wealth uh, like mm-hmm. to the community rather than just like keeping it for themselves, which, sure. I, which I find is cool. Yeah, not them other 20 niggas that we never heard of. <laughs> 50K. <clears throat> well, I guess ni- so. well, 19, I'm sorry. They need to start paying these podcasters, bro. There's a lot of good shows out here, including y'all's, man, that hey, man, let's try to put the word out man, there. Let's try to get on some of this politic money, bro. We, just, we, we know how to finesse. Some shit, I mean, I do. So we're a little too ignorant. We got we, they're not gonna give us money. We're saying Michelle Obama got a million. So. <laughs> Our president, got million. I, you gotta remember, you gotta, you, come on, man. We got, we got a president. So, unfortunately, unfortunately, we gotta get our money out the mud. Mo- uh, come on, bro. That's America, bro. You got a nigga that's in the office right now with 34 indictments and said he'll grab a bitch by the pussy. I don't really, I wouldn't go that far about America, bro. Hey, man, Rogan, Rogan endorses us. I think that was the like the last straw that got him over that, that hump there. I don't know, man. I'm still gonna go back to that. That anthem. The and one why it ain't on the soundboard. The bro. one with the. Why would it be on the soundboard? Bro, that's we're not Mexican, Joe. Jam, add, add it. Joe, you can figure out how to add it. My, Joe, we're not place. Mexican. Same last nigga. We're my not favorite Mexican. clip from y'all, bro, is when one of y'all pressed that button and it was like <laughs> some gay shit. Oh my God. Bro, yeah. Yeah. y'all love to point at me. Because it was you. You pressed it. <laughs> Anytime that shit pops up on my feed, I'll crack up for five minutes. I'm the one that was flabbergasted by the button. Bro. What? He. <laughs> Couldn't believe that nigga Funniest that thing shit. I never clipped it ever It was, was kind of messed up And when Joe was talking about That car accident he was in And I played the, oh, Mick, the yeah. Mick Foley <laughs> theme song That was so funny I remember that, I remember that. And he that played was, the Whopper song bro Like bro, when DeMar Hamlin just died just bought that Cadillac nigga And then I'm telling the story To these These two <laughs> idiots <laughs> I had told him like when I was on the way, I was like, "Damn, dog, I got into a car accident earlier." You get a nigga too much time, bro. And this nigga <laughs> queued it up on the soundboard. So in the middle of my story, yeah, bro, he cut the cut me off. Damn, 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 damn. He was out 
had a deep moment when <laughs> he'd be pausing for your like, downfall, bro, in the middle of a heartfelt story. Yeah, I had literally <laughs> paused. Right. He was a glass shatters. <laughs> he was. I did it. Da-da, 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 da-da. I did it. I did it because if he was all right and it wasn't his fault, so I was like, I get the jokes off, bro. That we'll was let, crazy. We we'll let the insurance handle it. It was super unexpected. Uh, until then, though. I'm gonna get these jokes off. It was very unexpected. He didn't even warn us. He just. But I can't even be mad now because I ended up fucking that Cadillac up running from some shit. We don't got to talk about that, man. Yeah. Uh, Connor, <laughs> let's talk about you, man. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's talk about something more positive. What's up? What's, up? What's the craziest shit you ever seen when you're doing, like, uh, pest control? I got a story for you on that. So, uh, actually, not too far away from this side of town. Uh, so, I used to take care of, like, anything from, like, ants, cockroaches, spiders to rats and everything. Like, I was telling oh, you about the homeless. No. Uh, this okay, one, Ghana? Huh? Never mind. <laughs> <laughs> I, got, I got plenty of pest control stories, but the one that fuck, fucked me up the most was I went to this house. It's an old, 100 year old house. I knock on the door. Lady opens the door. Five rats run away. Five? I'm like, no. whoa. What is this? At the no. door? At the door. What the fuck? And I was like, what the fuck? I was like, okay. So, whenever you're doing pest control, you go do an inspection, go you look know, around. You know it was stinking there. They were happy to get a fucking oh, door. Right. Get me out of here. They ran from her. When I tell you, it smelled so bad in the house too. Yeah. and I, like the main thing I remember is like you know the old houses where they have the, the electrical outlets on the like uh, baseboards right mm-hmm. yeah so I'm walking by and I look down on the ground and I see one's pushed out I had boots on so I just kicked it back in and all you see is a rat hand just come in a just rat put, yeah a rat hand? like an arm just push that bitch right back out oh my god I was like what the fuck am I dealing with dude I'm sitting here I was like this is like first six months on the job i'm like i don't know if i can do this <laughs> and i'm walking around and basically what happened is the rats infested the house they were living inside the couch in the living room of the house oh hell oh, yeah fuck? some like real shit they were sitting on the couch too? yeah bro like they would like the mom got up and you just saw another one run away i was like ooh. but the thing that got me like really fucked me up it was a little girl walks up to me shows me her toes when she was, <laughs> I thought you were laughing over there. Yeah, I don't, uh, <laughs> so no, I'm not laughing. I'm just <laughs> disgusted. I'm disturbed. Yeah, by no, I was disturbed too. So a little girl damn. walks up. The so basically like damn near to the knuckle of her toes were missing. Rats were eating on her toes at night. How oh. the fuck? Why yeah. the fuck? Yeah, Why bro. the fuck? Honestly, Why the fuck? Real shit, like on God, everything. Like I told this story on my podcast to people a bunch of times. It was, it was like the most fucked up situation I've ever seen. And so she's like, yeah, they chew on my feet at night, blah, blah, blah. This girl's like five, like young girl. Like, you what know. was so DC, DPS? So like, what? Get I got, out that I got more house. of the story for you there. So that whole thing happened. I, there was nothing I was going to be able to do that was going to be able to fix that house. I hope right. you guys understand. Like, right, right. So yeah. I threw like a thousand rat traps. I threw poison under the house, blah, 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 all that stuff. And when I do my job, you have to fill in your notes, and it goes to my job, and it goes to the company. It was a rental house, and mm-hmm. I'm not gonna say the company name, but um, <laughs> they sell the, the rental company that got my notes with like the pesticides I use, all that stuff. I bet it's JWC. Hey, hey come on, man. Hey. 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 We don't hey. we don't talk hey. shit about. African American businesses. Man, fuck JWC. If you watch it. Edit that out. That, Edit that out. That's not a that's I'm not, not, not black owned business. Oh really? That's a white owned business. I don't yeah, know. What you yeah, they're owned, yeah, owned by white people. They're owned by white people. hundred percent. I know the owners. Oh, never mind. Go on. Yeah. Anyways, so that happens, and um, I put my notes in. They get immediately. I get a call from the rental company. Like, hey, are you serious on your notes? I'm like dead ass serious. I'm like, like, you know, you take pictures. I didn't take pictures of the kid or nothing like that. Too young. Right. Um, that whole. So that happens, and then five minutes later. Uh, DCPS calls me five minutes five minutes calls me later and yeah they took the girl away I I felt bad about that because you're obviously taking a child away from the parent but I mean what are you gonna do bro that situation was fucked eating on toes at night is crazy imagine you waking up in a rat Sucking on your toes, <laughs> like, <laughs> you, see, you, see, like you see a tail like, like a, fluttering and like shit, bro. Some ribs, right? Just you're some horny ass rat. <laughs> sucking on your toes. <laughs> but, but I mean, I've seen that. I've seen people selling coke in front of me, going into their house, literally like bagging it up. Like, yeah, there's cockroaches in the in the fridge. I'm like, okay. Oh <laughs> shit. Yeah, another one. I was doing a turn, or no, I was doing a bed bug job. Homie flaps his sheets, and a freaking gun falls on the ground. I'm like, bro. <laughs> I'm, oh wow. I'm like, can we put the put the gun away real quick? Yeah. I was like, I was, <laughs> the fuck are you? doing you know like, i try to shoot the bed bugs but that shit ain't <laughs> oh, bro, you wouldn't like i swear people would have just rat poison they spray shit up in the air that would kill us if we sat in here in this room bro like all kinds of shit man and like there's a 
certain restaurants, uh, chicken restaurant. I can't say the name because I'm not trying to get defamation or anything like that. Chicken coop, it's sure okay. You tell you me say we oh, I got you. I got you all day, bro. Because he loves food trucks. So. I can tell. No, not I food truck. This chicken. is actual restaurant. This is actual restaurant. Big restaurants. Multiple. Popeyes. <laughs> no. It's okay, bro. Uh, but all that stuff like that. Like, I pulled like 40 rats out of one restaurant. 40? Oh, yeah. 40. Bro, oh, Jacksonville is filled. And, and, and it's not dog. and it's not just like it's not just across the bridge, bro. You go to Jack's Beach, all over the place, bro. And like and also people are just fucking dirty, bro. Right, right. I'll right. go into houses where like I used to have to carry a backpack <clears throat> and it was a backpack uh, vacuum cleaner and I have to go vacuum out like cockroaches and stuff, bro. Like, literally I would open I would open where you keep your cereal box. We were talking about cereal earlier. Open that up and everything's moving. Oh, oh yeah, German shit. cockroaches, all that shit. What's bro. a German cockroach? So a German cockroach is a real small Those roach about this. Big. And if you find one, there's a hundred of them somewhere. Yeah. 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 Oh, so. it's a little kind of big, but not big one. Yeah. When you got uh, one, you invested. When oh I was leasing God. apartments in North Carolina, yeah. somebody had them shits. I was like, oh, fuck. What we gonna do? They was like, shit, you gotta call today or tomorrow. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Nigga, everybody gonna be calling. Oh, oh my yeah. God. Yeah. And uh, the only, the scariest thing for me I ever did was, you know, we take care of those rental houses and a lot of times they're empty. People move out, they have you spray before people move in. Right. There's two times where I, the first one, I like, there's a lockbox on the door. They give you the code, get in the door, blah, blah, blah. And I unlock the door. And I look to my right, and I see two pink Crocs, and then a person just lunged at me. Wow, that's definitely JWC. Bro, when I tell you I turned Usain Bolt for like two seconds there, I'm slow (laughs) as fuck, but I ran down that road so goddamn quick. It scared the fuck out of me. Just a homeless person was in there, just ran out on me. It scared the shit out of me. Oh, they're squatting. Yeah, they're yeah, squatting. squatting. And like, yeah. like I said, not hating on the person, but when I tell you, like, made me fucking jump out of my skin, bro, I, like, freaked me the fuck yeah, out. I mean, like, hey, man, don't lunge at me, motherfucker. Just yeah. bring it up and leave. Yeah. Like, yeah. Right. It, was literally, it was like a bang, bang, like, in football. Like, you know, someone gets fucking hit, like, real quick. It was like yeah. that. I was like, bang, bang. I was like, holy shit. Yeah. <laughs> I ran down the street. Oh, wow. But, <laughs> yeah, like, 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 you don't expect to see nobody in a rental property that's supposed to be in. Nah, man. I was, just, I was going in there, bro. It's like five seconds. You go in there and spray, do your thing real quick, and then you're out. It's like it's like a 15-minute thing. It's nothing that takes too long. And just that kind of stuff. Like I said, just drug usage, man. Seeing people who have like 20 kids, not taking care of any of their kids, man. I'm just like, shit. But it's perspective. You know, it gives you a little bit of perspective on things. It makes me feel better about my life. Make sure I take care of my shit and make sure nothing nothing's going too bad. I used to tell my wife. I'd tell her stories. I'd send her pictures and shit. She hates bugs. She'd, like, call me mad. She's like, what the fuck are you saying these pictures for? <laughs> I believe it. Yeah, man. But, I mean, I've done that. I've worked a couple different jobs. I worked for, like, a car wrapping company. I've worked in restaurants for a long time. I said my first job ever was uh, Five Guys Burgers and Fries. Made uh, all the way from, you know, doing the register all the way to general manager. And I had all that kind of stuff. I'm sure, I don't know if either, any of you guys, I know you worked in uh, fast food for a while. Yeah, exactly. Fuck, fuck that place. <laughs> so me, me and them still have a beef uh, on social media. Right now. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Zaxby be talking shit, man. I seen Zaxby. They said they going to, uh, they moving up north. They going to like Jersey. I'm oh, like, wow. y'all, I'm like, y'all waited till y'all fell off before y'all started expanding up. Yeah, because they don't know it'd be new to them. No, I think people know now that Zaxby's his ass now. <laughs> There's a lot of other people that still want to get it, bro. <laughs> it's like I also feel like it's like Canes, bro. You know, it's like overhyped kind of thing. I, I finally had that while I was out like mm-hmm. Louisiana this past time. I ordered like three or four times, and I'm like. For one, they don't have ranch. That pissed me off. Oh, they don't you have ordered, ranch. First they don't of have all, ranch. you said you ordered it three or four times. You like it. No, <laughs> yeah, yeah, you ordered it, it, was, it was the closest thing to me. That's, uh, I could literally go Kane, walk across the Kane's street. Kane's not that bad. It's just like, bro, it's just chicken strips and toast. Just get more sauces, God damn it. They got their own. They make their own they shit. Serve chicken strips? Yeah, yeah chicken strips, it. toast, and then not a little. Even, my nigga, not even a chicken strip sandwich. No, 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 sir. Oh, they do. Just, they got a chicken strip sandwich. Right, not the one in the But it's just the same thing. It's just the toast <laughs> with the two stick. Yeah, bro, they, they menu is limited. It's like the menu is literally just a little box. I ain't gonna hold you. I do fuck with spots like that, but it's gotta be something I really fuck with. Like in Pensacola, they got a spot called Fish and Grits. Man, that's some of the best motherfucking fried fish you'll ever have. They're the reason why Dr. Umar's so mad. I was about to say, they spent grits. $20 million in grits over there? Yeah, they spent $20 million. Yeah. Yeah. Goddamn grits. <laughs> nah, bro, like, to be honest, man, like, my that's favorite. That's all they serve. My favorite fast food to this day is Whataburger, bro. That's it. Wow. I love me some Whataburger, bro. I wouldn't even put them in my top. I wouldn't even put them in my top. I like Whataburger. Whataburger fucking hits, bro. I hate Whataburger. What? What What do you get from there? What do you have? Just their burgers? I mean, I've had the uh, chick that chicken strip honey barbecue sandwich they had a while. You don't ago. like that? It was, I mean, it was. Oh, that, that, that I had liquor first. So. 
Yeah. All right. <laughs> uh, what else? I'm not going on my way to go to Water. What else? Uh, I've had a. Uh, what makes you say Whataburger ain't that? You know what well, I mean? Well, because like, their burgers hey. wasn't really that seasoned. I know you want to go hard. No, for no, no. Them, but the burgers definitely don't be seasoned. But for me, you get a big ass burger. It's like fat, bro. It's like, like yeah, they don't yeah. have a big ass burger. Of season but hold up, hold up. Gotta you got to add, add shit into it. I don't want to have to add somewhere that I'm yeah, already yeah, paying I add for. Jalapenos to my shit. Okay, you know that's what I'm saying. I'm not no goddamn jalapenos in no burger. What you mean? That's all you got. It's burger. It's burger place. I hit that. Put the shit on for you. Yeah, nigga. Now you absolutely right. You I don't, I don't want to have to adjust my burger for me to fucking. It's an option. It, just, it got on the menu. Like, do you want to <laughs> add? Because it don't. I don't think it come with cheese. Like, do you want yeah, cheese? Yeah, do yeah, you? Because yeah. water burger, you gotta like kind of customize it because it's just like a straight up it's burger. It's just a bland you, burger. Yeah, like, you just gotta tell them what you want on it. It's yeah. like it's like make my burger. It's like a sub. I ain't gonna say sub. Uh, like, it, but it's kind of like a sub. Yeah, it's like, for it's like if you don't tell them that's what you want, they're not gonna put it on it. Yeah, so I'm like, I want some, I want some seasoning on my damn burger. Dude. Man, I'm about to start this motherfucking burger <coughs> review channel. I'm down you with should, you, bro. Man. I'm a burger fiend, bro. It's, I love it's that a lot shit. of places that, that I want to. I want to do this with, with Joe so bad, but he don't like cheese, and I tell Joe, I don't like cheese. I like I like cheese. I like cheese. Make or break some burgers. Yeah, bro. True. I can true. give you that cheese make or break some things for sure. Like I can't, you can't eat a Philly cheese without cheese. You the whiz was out, bro. Yeah, right. Yeah. Yeah. You can't eat nachos. <laughs> you try just eating your burgers with like mozzarella cheese on it? Nah. You eat pizza? Nah. Really? That shit don't don't. That shit don't. Like I've had it all before. I've had a mozzarella on my on my burger. I've had uh, American on my burger. Swiss on my burger. I don't like none of that shit on my. But burger. you eat pizza. See, you about to hate me. I love blue. I, I love blue it. cheese, bro. Yeah, I like nah, blue cheese. Blue cheese hits, bro. That's I hate blue cheese. Blue cheese, 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 blue cheese, cheese buffalo, with the cheese. buffalo sauce yeah. on it, bro. Blue, blue cheese on a burger, on right cheese. wings. Blue cheese delicious. Yes, sir. Actually goes crazy. Only with buffalo wings. And I don't even like cheese. cheese. Anything else. But oh, blue cheese I don't know about you, Connor, but the blue cheese when it got the chunks in it. Yeah, bro. Oh nah, my nah, god, that's, that's, that's the part. That's the ones you put on burgers. I always see people put blue cheese chunks on burgers. Yeah. Like, uh, I like the, the, the crumble. I like blue movie, cheese burger. What that show you speak of? Uh, 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 like diners and uh, oh, with Guy Fieri. Yeah, Guy Fieri. Drivers dive. Yeah. Every Fuck, time right, he had to make him a burger, he put those blue cheese chunks on that shit. I'm like, but see, but see no. those things. Like, I like to cook. I was like, I've grown up cooking, so I've yeah. just kind of tried a bunch of stuff, man. Yeah. And I'm also not picky very much. Like my wife, she'll if there's like fucking a tomato on there, she'll freak out type thing. But like when it comes to that, man, you gotta you gotta try the different cheeses, bro. See, blue cheese fucking high, hits, bro. I'm, I'm on that shit, bro. If I get high, then I can do the um, I can like I can tolerate the cheese. Better, Everything tastes you know better with a little smoke in it, bro. 100. Right, right, right. Blue sure. cheese only tastes good. With Hot wings. But like if I'm not high, I taste I that cheese. That, like yeah. bro, t- cheese on a burger to me ruins my. I feel like it's, it's dry. Literally been it's going dry. on for hundreds of years. How bro, does the fuck does it? Make, no, a hamburger has been going on for hundreds. And of cheese years. been like now at least of the month. Think about it. There are so many <laughs> ways, so many variations of a hamburger without cheese. Cheese is like an accessory, niggas decided. <laughs> niggas was like, oh my God, you know, let me just add this one disgusting it thing. Was a mon- it, it was a monumental one decision. Disgusting. Monumental you know, decision. Just, oh, you're like, I can um, respect that. You're like Big Boss. Uh, Man, they burgers, oh my God. Big Boss, I don't think I've ever had you that. Been, you, mm. you been a Big Boss ever? Not yet. Man, it's he sent me, trip. they had BOGO one day. If I was in yeah, the book, I would like, a free burger. I'm mad because he, he do all the deals and he don't be over. He used to be over here by the. It little, was a 35 minute drive. Yeah, what's Damn. the shit like the little Damn, kennel, the kennel over here? Yeah, which, is, okay. which is crazy that you got a food truck in front of a, a, a pet dog, hospital. Yeah, yeah, that's, yeah, that's, that's hilarious. hilarious. <laughs> your, dog gets, your dog gets surgery and you're eating a burger outside real quick. <laughs> <laughs> Is that my dog? Hey, y'all take care of him now. <laughs> yeah. they, use the, they use the dogs for meat over there, bro. Hey, man, I need to see y'all inventory. Lassie, right delicious. <laughs> I what, love that, nigga. What, what, what's y'all's, like, favorite food, then, when it comes to, like, say, fast food, bro? Say you smoke, you just, are you drinking, hanging out? What's, what's like, your, y'all's go-to? Checkers. What am I? Checkers? checkers. Yeah. Say, bro, you lose me on the... Good. Make your own sandwich, Oh, wait, no, yeah, not that. checkers. I'm thinking of um, <laughs> crystals. I'm thinking crystals. Oh, no, yeah, I, I hate crystals. Scott, I'm with you. I'm with you. I'm with you on checkers then. I'm with man, you on that. When okay. I was up in North Carolina, spent five years up there, right? Five, six years. Um, come back, bro. I'm craving crystals. That's for crazy. whatever reason. What is wrong? With Hadn't you? had it in all that time. I had this imagination, like they they hot spicy crystal chicks. Nah, yeah. bro. Them nah, shits nah. used to go crazy. 
Them shits used to go crazy. You're not, you're not tripping, Joe. Crystal used to be good back in Bro, the day. Bro, Crystal Crystal's used to swing. Oh, my God. Crystal used to be good as fuck. I just don't so like I Crystal So I come back, brothers. I'm craving the shit. My thing about Crystal's bros, I feel like I'm going to get robbed every time I walk up to one of them, bro. You will. Nah, no, yeah. fuck that, like, like, five out of ten times, you're going to get stabbed. It every happens. time I eat Crystal's now. Especially that one on Dunn Avenue. Yes. Especially that one on Dunn mm-hmm. Avenue. It made me feel like you eating regurgitation. Like, the, the, the bread is <laughs> oh, not. The bread too soft. Yo, too soft. Yo, yeah, shit, like, soft. It's, no, no, it's no, like they dip it, be, it in it, water. It be legit wet. Then they no, they no, no mayo. The <laughs> no mayo, just mustard and pickle and onions. Who signed off on this? Who want this I don't know if you ever like have y'all like ever like watched them in the window make it. No. They put the buns on the grill with the meat. Yeah. So that yeah. I think I never tried it, but somebody, back in the day somebody, it used to be good the way they did it. Somebody but. should tell them not to put the bun like make mine, don't put the bun on the grill too. Yeah. I don't know if that I might didn't, take I didn't I think, know they did it like that. I think what they Bro, they they put the bun on the grill with the raw ass meat. I think they put water on that grill. And they do. They squirt it, they squirt it, and then they put the bun. Why are you putting already baked something that's already baked on the hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. They're squirting something. Back in the day, that shit. <laughs> used to be fine because it was like I think they used to use a little butter on their shit though. They on the would buns? like butter the bun or something. I, I think know, I know man. what you're talking about. That's what it. That's what I remember. That's, 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 you know what I'm if, you, if you like crystals, you like White Castle? You ever had White Castle? I was about to say that. That's a completely different thing. Two completely different things. White Castle tastes it's in Miami. Good good white in time. White Castle is actually yeah. good. Yeah. Crystal yeah. Is yeah. White Castle is good as fuck. And they're fun. bigger. The burgers I are bigger than Crystal like, burgers. You can get like a fat ass box of 20 of them, bro, for like 20 bucks. You probably don't remember, but when we went to New York, we had White Castle. And that shit tore my stomach up. I don't oh, think it does. It, it'll fuck you up. It'll fuck you up. It's good time for that, bro. Bro, when we went to yeah, we went to New York. I had got the first night there. We got I remember I got white cap. Bro, I was shitting that all four days. <laughs> nah, I, I remember could, me I and Russell and that big and we Christopher. got some nasty ass yeah. tacos, bro. I remember that. I ain't getting them. Dog, I I wanted to throw up the entire night, nigga. Yeah. Oh my god, bro. I ain't getting no. It was a uh, it was a food truck. I ain't careful those food trucks, bro. I ain't get that shit because everybody was eating. It was like two, three in the I, morning. I ran out of money at that point. I was Bruh. poor. <laughs> <laughs> we looking around like, oh, New York, don't go to sleep, nigga. The whole entire block is is dead, right? Mm-hmm. But this little ass food truck is popping. It's got like fifteen people outside of it. We like, what the fuck is it? What are y'all even doing out at this hour? Yeah. Yeah. We order two tacos, bro. We go to eat them bitches, dog. I immediately wanted. I I grand slam my shit into the fucking <laughs> trash, nigga. Like I was mad as fuck. That nigga Russell ate a few more bites. I think I don't even know if he finished it, but he was like, man, I was hungry. I had to eat what I could, dog. I think both of us was sick from that shit. Damn, yeah, I'm not eating no taco from food, the food truck. Like we had the worst experience that time. That sucks. Yeah. Bro. We got to go back and have another food. Venture. It's been a minute since I've been to New York, bro. I did have a question for one of y'all's travel <coughs> travel videos, bro. I, I brought it up to both y'all on the pod. Uh, you guys travel until like Luxottica and all that stuff, oh, yeah, going yeah, to the yeah. porn conventions, bro. Yeah. That's some that was some wild shit that I saw. Yeah. What was that experience for you guys like? Did you clap any cheeks? Nah, I wanted uh, to. I saw you with real old rider, bro. I was very yeah, jealous. Yeah, Shit, yeah. you bring like a band. I she put that, that short. In my hand. Hey, I man, I'm gonna I'm call. I'm gonna call Devin out, man. We could have went this year. Lex Landry wanted to take us. He didn't want to go with me. Why you ain't invite me? I on, did invite you. It was, like, it was like last minute. It was on a damn Sunday. I did invite you. And I was you at what? church. You had something. I was in church. church. I had you had church. something going on. You, with, you, you were feeling a little warm safe. in yeah, church. I was, I, was lead, about I was leading a song in church and I couldn't go. It wouldn't look too good on yeah, my Yeah, it was. She did, t- <laughs> she did tell us last minute, but I was like, bro, we ain't doing that. Uh, Joe, you had a, you literally had like three events at the safe house. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah I think it was a book weekend at that time. Yeah, and she had told us like on a Tuesday and it was like Friday, but I was like, man, fuck it, bro, let's go. None of us going to work right now. Right, right, she was right, about right, to pay right, for right. everything. He didn't want to go with me. I, like, I ain't going by myself. Yeah. Like, Should have went by yourself, bro. Well, you could next year. Could have got famous, bro. Could have got famous. Make, make, make some yourself. good content doing yeah, that shit. Yeah, hanging yeah, out with her. My face and some ass next time. <laughs> but when we, oh, but oh. when we went, it was cool because yeah, like no. they, they were doing we'll that. You could do that. Like you, you can do that. Yeah. yeah. 
I saw a bro with a uh, bro, they nasty doing. shirt on at one time. Bro, shit. literally, it's they like it's time. like a section. It's like twenty beds, and you could bring one of the porn stars to the bed and just have them like ride you and shit like that. In real life, like you like dick all all the way out. No, just, like, nobody's the, nobody's uh, naked in there. Nobody's like actually naked. You in got there. enough money in that pocket, bro. I, bet, I bet they'd be more than happy to. Yeah, yeah. Like, yeah. let me chat on yeah. yeah. But shit, like a lot of the people walking around be like OnlyFans. They be big on OnlyFans and yeah. shit. They be fucking some of the the porn stars type shit, right? And they be like, yo, after this, what y'all doing? We going to this content house. Are they gonna gonna fuck me? Like, yeah, it was a couple girls like, hey, after this, we gonna we gonna party after this. And And y'all didn't go. Nah, they was in some other shit. What the hell is other shit than porn? One of them was one of them looked like carrot top. (laughs) It was legit, Uh, like standing behind with the shoulders broad as fuck. And was like, yeah, I'm putting the strap on. Type oh shit. my yeah. god! Yeah, yeah. I was like, yeah, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I'm good on that. That was funny because you told her she should do uh, what's the what's the snowboarder name with the orange hair? Sean White. Yeah, yeah. Sean White. Yeah, 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 yeah. told her she should do a porn at Sean White because yeah. <laughs> she looked like hair top. Yeah. At a snowboard, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, with bro. the strap. I don't want. Yeah. I don't want <laughs> any woman right. that looks like Sean White and or Carrot Top. <laughs> nah, no, bro. and he said she was bulky. Fuck that. Yeah, yeah, she was doing. Sure. She was doing porn and like her gimmick was Carrot Top. We was like, you know, actually like Sean White. <laughs> she probably, I mean, more like she's probably doing that now. After we left, I ended up seeing her. One of her pawns, like the both the couple, yeah. they was like doing a, a tag team shit. And it was like a nigga that was uh on the other side. And then he was like, What's up? And she was like, she had this weird oh. demeanor. Everything had this like huh. You know that yeah. kind of. You gotta show me this one after the show. Johnny, I, 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 I ain't trying to find that. Hell nah, bro. That. It sounds like she fucks you. You don't to... fuck her. It's basically bro, what it sounds yeah, like. They yeah, loaded the strap up in the car. They was too confident <laughs> with like, yeah, y'all could come. I was like, nah. Yeah, nah, she's yeah. gonna strap you up. Also, I heard like them them porn party. Them shit's kind of weird. Like. It's like a dating party, bro. At the end of the day, bro, we some family, man. I'm not trying. I'm not about to sit after, up and watch people shit, fucking. Yeah, after the shit, old uh, old girl told us that one time. I was like, you know what? Yeah, that, that don't. Oh no! Nah, if I go to a content house, you gonna see me on OnlyFans. You just wear a mask, bro, or a scarf. What if they don't have one? I don't want to see my boy <laughs> Joe. <laughs> I don't see my boy. There's just some things I don't need to see. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna man. come I'm across. I'm gonna give y'all nothing. the heads up. Don't watch OnlyFans for the next three months. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? That's it's, hard. It's, yeah, that's hard, bro. Like, I watched that shit on the way over here. Like, we want me to. We want to do. I was just gonna be like, "Hey, your favorite content creator might have came." Just, just be specific <laughs> with the person you work with, and I won't watch none of that shit. He's gonna walk up, be like, "What's up? It's Mr. Jefferson." Yeah, <laughs> I'm like, oh, Big shit. Dick Swanger. <laughs> all right, that's crazy. And then you guys, uh, who's that? Um, who's that white girl you guys have had on a couple times? She's I've just seen her make some content for a couple times. She uh, Alexis, Alexis Andrews. Andrews. Yeah, bro. Yeah. She actually pretty cool in person. Oh, I'm not hating. No, no hating in any way, shape, or form. I've seen her videos of like her going to like the beaches and like going to the bars and us and one homeboy was like, I could like fit my dick in my ass or some yeah, shit. Yeah, that I was, was like, what the fuck? One. That yeah. was uh, yeah, he said he could that suck was insane. Yeah, he said he sucks. She had asked me to clip that. That's how I got you. I clipped it. Hey, you- <laughs> That was crazy. When he said he suck his own dick. See, when she I was asked that. when I was um, cause I, I was a cameraman for that. I didn't hear that because it was live. It was on That's Riverside, crazy. so loud as shit. Uh, yeah. yeah. So they just like, oh my god. Yeah. I'm like, was what like, what the, the fuck going on? What the fuck he said? <laughs> I Girl, went back there. She, I saw that. I was like, I can't believe this got posted. Yeah, Would you I, admit I, that I, on yeah. camera? There's like some things like I ain't gonna say that on camera. That bro. guy didn't. Have I won't be honest. Apparently. It's weird, but like I'll it, that make people watch the video. Oh, one I added that one first. Yeah, It'd be some shit. I'll be like, bro, I don't know, but our our fan be liking that shit. So I, like, I, don't, oh, I don't know which fans, but yeah, it man. Get, it's one of I, I, it's crazy. Bro, I couldn't wait to <laughs> tell somebody that. No, nah, he was very he excited was, about it. Like you saw his face. As soon his as he was, was asked, yeah, yeah, yeah. He looked up like <laughs> <laughs> this is the moment I've been sorry. waiting for. Right right here, no, he said it, and that was his wife next to him. Yeah. Oh, like, bro, what the? Fuck? I mean, oh, no, obviously yeah, she knew wife, who she that, married. That lady next to him, that was I, th- wife. I thought that was crazy, but I'm like, well, she must know who she married. She ain't bad eyes. She was clearly a stranger. She was like, yeah, I was there with him. Oh, she didn't say that. But yeah, yeah, yeah. They, they swingers, bro. That's, what, like, that's yeah, what that means I, to me, bro. Yeah, I pushed his legs towards his mouth, type shit. Like, <laughs> yeah, did. it was crazy. <laughs> it was crazy. Also, when we imagine him giving you the people's elbows, <laughs> <laughs> bro. When we uh, when we filmed that, I, I thought I was, I thought I was about to get into some shit because um, it was some it was, um black Israelites, and they black was they Israel. was it was some black Israelites. They thought out. you was one of them. 
No, no, no. They were Why black. are you shooting this, my black brother? Yeah. <laughs> oh, no, no, no. I, I, I know you're talking about. I ran into them because they, they be hanging out in uh, Riverside Park with a big globe at. They be yeah. hanging out there. Like, because one time I asked them if they had a job application, but go on. Yeah, it was. It <laughs> what was, they doing? Passing out Kendrick Lamar? They were just, they were, they were just in their clothes reciting some shit. And I was yeah, with a chick out black there. Black Israelite shit. Mm-hmm. So um, she was asking people what's the freaky shit they did in their bedroom. So I see the black Israelites coming up and I was like, don't talk to them. She Definitely. don't listen. Of course not. I was like, don't no, talk to them. Not. They're black Israelites. She's like, I don't know what that is. So she going up to them asking, um, uh, what's the freaky shit they didn't do in their bedroom? We were like, they were like, oh, we don't, we don't. He start doing the black Israelite shit, and he handed up like a black Israelite pamphlet. pamphlet. Yeah, they always got the pamphlets on. There. <coughs> she always. took. She the dude was jumping in like the camera, just talking like on the over on the video. She took the black Israelite pamphlet and balled it up and threw it on the ground. Oh, you don't ball on the pamphlet. I'm like, I gotta fight. I like, damn, I like, I gotta fight for black Israelites for a white. You know how long it takes them to print them? Podcast. You know how long it takes them to print them uh, pamphlets off an of IBM computer? Yeah, a lot like, a week. I'm gonna be honest. I don't really give a fuck. <laughs> I, don't, I, don't, I don't. I don't give a fuck about black Israelites. I don't. <laughs> I don't but either, anyway, bro. but yeah, the dude. He looked at me. He tried to size me up, and I was like, "I ain't with that shit." So they like walked down. He went down. Oh, he went. He waited. He got three blocks down. He like, "Fuck that white bitch." Oh. He like, I'll never talk to a white bitch. And I was like, all I'm right. sure she's he got made, he, made, he went three blocks down, but I was like, we could, that could, none of that could have happened. No. Nah. Yeah, Cause nah. I was like, they could have beat me up or some shit like that. They would have definitely beat you yeah. up, bro. Other than oh, that, he wanted to beat me up. Oh, they that nigga, together would have had to beat me up. That nigga would have beat me up. They would have stomped you in them Kappa boots. They yeah. Yeah. They definitely I mean, one of them dudes had boots. Yeah. The other ad is like, they were like, Cool with it. They didn't give a fuck. It was yeah. just that one particular. He one. was extreme. He was yeah, a radical. He, yeah, he was like he watched too much YouTube. He was the go yeah. off nigga. Hell Every, no. Everybody got their crash out. I crash out as Joe. We just established that already. <laughs> we already established that. You everybody are, got everybody you are, they crash out. It's it's cool. That's Joe would have fought that nigga. It's no question. Joseph the explosive. Yeah, <laughs> Joseph the explosive. <laughs> I fuck with that. Shirts Me coming. Too. Shirts coming soon. <laughs> we ready. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> have a ticking time bomb. Be a nigga in a suit with his head, with his head like exploding. Nah, you gotta have um, that little girl from Rush Hour in the in the in the uh, in the bomb in the bomb. Oh, bus. in the bomb. Who had the buzz on? Oh. Press the button. Press the damn button. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm dead as fuck. Man. That's, that's funny, man. All right, let's get into uh, <laughs> voicemails, man. We ain't really got much to uh, no topics for us. Fuck so that white voicemail. bitch. Yeah, that was crazy. Like like, that. That's crazy. <laughs> on Riverside, that could be anybody. It nah. could have been anybody. <laughs> <laughs> so many white bitches on the Riverside. <laughs> I told her, ass, don't talk like man. Do not talk to them Israelites. Come bro. on, she Alexis. <laughs> she don't not listen. Remember that time she cooked us sausage and give us none. Move with the house. <laughs> You don't have to break it. <laughs> nah, the main video I remember she is. She was not one, bro. I'm like, I thought she was cooking for us. She, she treated your ass like Craig. Yeah. <laughs> like, why would you even break it up? Like, nah, I remember the video you talking to her, bro. Breakfast. And she was talking about her fake tits. And you're like, I see him. She's like, sure. I was like, I was I mean, like, what the fuck? I mean, most porn, porn stars are cool as fuck. No, I'm not hating teams. on it. I, was just, I wasn't prepared for so like, yeah, like quick as fuck on it. If a yeah. woman voluntarily, voluntarily tells you she got fake titties, yeah. she's going to show them. Yeah. Yeah. Porn, porn stars, the ones I've met, it's they not even a cool question. Sale, right? Is she a porn star? Or she like OnlyFans model kind of thing. She's she porn star. Porn she, star. Yeah, she do like yeah. things. She's she she like actually done. professional. Yeah, right? she's done shit with. Yeah. No hate, bro. But they usually cool as fuck. Make like, that back, the bro. I, the ones I met, they usually pretty yeah. cool. Yeah, for the most part, man. Shout out to the hoes. Hey, man, what's that you smacking? The- oh, nah. <laughs> That's my Zen. I got you. Got that, you. that nicotine. Yeah, I heard yeah that, what this man just said. Did you? Tell me, yeah, sh- shout out to the hoes. <laughs> yeah, shout out to the hoes. They, roll they are hoes. They at least they know. All right, man. Let's uh, let's get into these voicemails. The Senate voicemails hit us up. 424-260-RAOP. 424-260-RAOP. This one, first one is, man, we've been asking for him to uh, send one in, man. We got Xavier back. Oh, okay. Hey. That's what's up. Yeah, all right. Let's get into it. Hopefully this play. I ain't tested out. I'm, I'm oh, looking at some man. of these words. Seven <laughs> it's Xavier. Colorado Springs, by the way, of Pensacola, Florida. Shout out to Joe. Roof, roof. roof. Motherfucker, roof. Boo, boo. Yeah. Boo, boo, boo. And shout out to Amp. 
Uh, you don't get no shout out. Sorry. I don't shout out to give a fuck about shout out to you too. said shout out to Devin. Um, you know, it's it right Washington there. Day. My question don't have anything to do with that shit. But <laughs> hypothetically, the next president <clears throat> calls up to REOP <laughs> and they're like, hey, there's a meteor strike to Earth Dude. right now. Dude. And we know y'all ain't no milkman. No milkmen, but the only way on. that we can draw, we can dodge this meteor, is by one of y'all, or by both of y'all, either smashing Caitlin Clark or Taylor <laughs> Swift. Oh, oh, Taylor Swift. Who's taking that. the bullet? Back shot. Who's, who's taking Caitlin Clark, and who's taking Taylor Swift? Mm. I know y'all ain't no milkman, but yo. Damn. Who's doing it for the universe? Keeping <laughs> up, y'all, man. It's been a minute, but yo, I love y'all, man. Appreciate all the context, content. It's all love, bro. Peace and love. I think ninety percent of the time, dog, he, Xavier. I think ninety percent of the time he calls her, he be either high and or drunk. <laughs> y'all ain't into no white girls. I said, I know he said I'm no. I'm into no. a lot of white girls, no, okay. but I can't say I'm on air. <laughs> Yeah, it's a, it's, a, it's a couple. I can't admit to it. <laughs> All um, right, so we got to pick who take one for the team. So Caitlin Clark's scary, bro. So, Joe, you the youngest, so you got to take mean, one for I the team. Clark, so one of us got to smash Kate. Oh, you already took it, so we didn't need to touch yeah, it. Yeah, he said, so he said Kate, Taylor Swift. For the universe? Yeah, Caitlin. I'm a mom Caitlin Clark. at that point. The way Caitlin Clark be balling, I know she a freak. They both tall as fuck. Yeah, oh. All basketball players are freaks. I like, heard Kevin Clark the might book. suck it from the back, bro. So I'm trying to see that's that man man. Nah, bro. You guys see the video of her swimming in the pool, bro? She wear a full like sports bra and everything. I'm like, mm. for real. Mm-hmm. She got a boyfriend though. Why she don't dress sexy? She might fuck me. Yeah. She might. Ooh. She might. I mean, like, strap you. She pulled the strap on you. She, she, nah, 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 nah. she ain't strapping me now. I don't know, bro. <laughs> that's, 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 that's not like some Kevin Clark shit. It's not crazy either way. What you gonna put in your leg, man? Yeah. Nah, she gonna put you in a pretzel? Nah, yeah. she just might. She just might be throwing <laughs> me around. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I mean, if she put home. me in a pretzel. That's crazy. Bitch, oh. you ain't getting no points. Lock your legs around me, nigga. Like, Bitch, man, you ain't yeah. getting no points pulling them. Um, what she you call the moves, words, too? Oh. Oh. I mean, at yeah. that point, <laughs> she be eating like she having. If you wearing like me she, like she a purse, she, she gonna do you like on Deuce Bigelow. Nah, <laughs> when you nah, fuck hey, that big, hey. that big one. Yeah, yeah. Hey, she she tie him up and, and and be like call a nigga Angel Reese. That's all that oh, she'll do. That's bro. crazy. She be like, ain't your name Angel Reese tonight, nah, nigga? Uh, Taylor Swift's a billionaire though, bro. Oh yeah, with a no, no. Taylor Swift smash Taylor, 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 Taylor Swift getting it yeah. without without the Beat universe on the line. That, right. This is a regular Tuesday. I'm, I'm yeah. smashing Taylor. She Swift. could fly you around the world ten times, and it won't even like affect her like her she like could, pockets. She could fly me to yeah. New Orleans, and I, yeah. Well, she ain't gotta fly me. No, see, I'm high she ain't even gotta fly you. Well, I was just saying, bro. Like, I'm making my own way, goddamn it. <laughs> Bullshit. She paying me to go. You know what I'm no, saying, she gonna pay me for what I do. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, she the she the white Beyonce. So yeah, of course, it's this only right. Dick ain't free. Yeah, 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 yeah for real. Most I'm definitely. gonna go to a full concert. Most repeat he should have did worse white women than that. Cause like either one of them gonna go for me. It requires a college degree. That means <laughs> there's some rough white women out there, man. I understand. I'm yeah, oh, yeah. No, no, either no, one of definitely them. Definitely something that can I'll get. Go. It. Don't go for me. I'm good either way. See, my issue with white women, just being honest. <laughs> Beside the man, white There's like a 90% chance she ain't got no ass. You ain't wrong. In 2024? Not all white women. That's crazy. BBLs are a huge thing. They nah. evolving, bro. You ain't never seen that. They are evolving, bro. You never seen that Twitter BBL hashtag, man. hashtag white women evolving? No, 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 no. I am seeing that these white women getting these booties, but they look, you know, they ain't fully developed yet. They look funny. Mm. They, they look evolve, fun. They still got time to evolve. Like, you know what I'm saying? They got, they got a couple time, more years. Yeah. You know what I'm There's some snow bunnies it's, out there, bro. It's like yeah. next generation booty coming. You know mm. what I mean? Like, And I'm going to be too old for that. So they ain't won me over You ain't yet. never too old, bro. What you mean? That's crazy. You uh, never too old for a white woman. That's true. I could be 60 still fishing. Yeah, bro. You know how we were talking about uh, sugar mamas and stuff, bro. Yeah. Shit, right there. There you go. The, especially the divorce ones. Oh yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I ain't gonna That's hold a new you. Market. Market. I don't know what be up with older white women, but they be having that wagon on. They be, they be, <laughs> yeah. they be having a wagon. <laughs> yeah. About wagon. Um, <laughs> 
You ever watch that? Know. You ever watch that show with uh, Jason Sudeikis? He like a, a soccer coach. Oh, um, shit. What's that? Um, Ted Lasso. Yeah, yeah. Fire. Ted Lasso. Right, yeah. Fire. That, that amazing. That, that show. cougar white woman oh, on the, there that on the team. Oh my god. That. Oh, yes, that one. Hey, man, oh, oh my I god! Might, I might, oh my god! I might be sick, but that one from the convention that got the clip of the old white, the old white woman. Oh no! I might take her down, bro. I'm sorry. Convention? You talking about the lady who was wearing the black dress? The sixty-something year old woman. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Take her down. She would have got. She, she would have got, got it, bro. Nigga, take she was fucking bro. with you. Yeah, yeah, she was. Take her down. But her husband was like right there. Yeah, bro. That he nigga was, he was, was like 6'5". Like, he, 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 he was a nigga. He was probably... He was a nigga. Nah, nah, nah. He probably was a cook. He was like 6'5". Hey, he bro. Was that a nigga was standing like Kevin Nash. Yeah. On the other side of the table. I was like, uh... <laughs> She'd be able to show you things that I don't think like, you would even yeah. know. Yeah. She was bro. talking like she was finna take me home. She <laughs> was? Nigga, no, she wasn't talking. She was going... She, I mean, and I he was gonna watch in the corner and chill. Nah, that's smoking crazy. a cigarette. That's oh, crazy. not the cuck chair, bro. Oh, you yeah. can't, you can't definitely the cuck chair. You, can't. <laughs> you ever go in the hotel nah. room, bro? And there's that random chair in the corner. Yeah. You know what that chair is for, yeah. bro? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You meet a man on Craigslist and you yeah. have a banging wife, crazy in the chair. Oh, I've seen this on strippers in the hood. I've been there. You're crazy. I don't have a wife. Have you ever been to a hotel and y'all be looking at that bitch? You like, bro? I've seen this on a flick before. Oh. Uh, yes, I was in Gibbstown, New Jersey. I don't want to. The be whole in that hotel, hotel looked like a like they shoot flicks in there, bitch, bro. I'm certain they did. Yeah, bro. I was in. I've ho- been to a hotel and it looked like they killed people in there. Yeah, that's, that's every it. hotel. I was in it, bro. <laughs> Any of those random little motels on the side of the road, bro? That's death. That's straight yeah, up death yeah, on the side. Super, super yeah, death. I was in this hotel one time. And I was looking at that shit. I was like, bro, I seen this hotel on the Habib show. Mm-hmm. And if you know who the Habib show is, you're a freak. Yeah, yeah. you're you're, you're a sick you're, boy. You're a freak. You're I'm a sick boy. I know all the hotels. <laughs> Especially where you be at, man. Yeah. <laughs> I, don't, I need a list of hotels not to go to. One's Devin, oh God. Devin go to hotels where you got to pay uh, hourly. Oh, not the That's hourly one. Right. Check out is whenever the fuck your money run out. This one check out is not eleven. It's man, I'm gonna go money. to the motels you can pay in cash. Bro, yeah, oh, for sure. Definitely bro, the sure. last time I was in a hotel, it was in when I went to Philly a couple months ago. Bro, this was state. Bro, the lady. Bro, every second, <laughs> I went to check out. You like eleven? Yeah. Bro, every five minutes she was knocking on the door. She was like, "You, you going How you staying extra?" The, I was like, "God damn." The lady no. at the counter was that? No, like the the uh, ladies that clean the hotel, oh, like the, the oh. what they call it. My my brain uh, not working. Man. Housekeeper. Oh yeah. Philly's yeah. a different place though, bro. They they're like that up there up north. Yeah, I was like, God damn. Yeah, they definitely ask. That's why I put. That's why you got to put the do not disturb yeah. on the door. They won't even fuck with you. <laughs> nah, good, that bitch was on the door. She didn't give a fuck. Damn. The chick out was eleven. I can understand that, but yeah. God damn. damn. She she was, I, was taking, I was taking my time because my flight wasn't until like two p.m. She was trying to turn the rooms and get going. Nigga. You yeah, yeah. Up. she was flipping them rooms. Let me ask y'all a question. So, mm-hmm. have, I'm undefeated with this. Have y'all ever went out of town and you get there like way before checking? I'm undefeated. Every time I ask, I always get. They always let me do yeah, the early check. Yeah, yeah, no, I'm 100%. undefeated. Because they, 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 they I don't some, even think it really matters. There's some people that don't be. I'm real. I, last time we went to LA, <laughs> bro, the checking wasn't at 3 p.m. Bro, I got to LA like eight in the morning. Yeah. Oh damn, bro, you're that I, early? I, bro, I was like, bro, I'm, I don't think I've ever been that successful. Like my really? flight gets delayed or like yeah. something happens, and I'm always like. The next day type shit Like I get in 2 o'clock in the morning 3 Shit Well we went to uh, uh, LA I think I pulled up Like at 9pm Yeah He had got there He was Legit chilling This nigga had his I socks in, off I was in LA <laughs> <laughs> I was in nah, I was in, bro, you been here too long. Bro. <laughs> nah, I think, seven I, I, think I had got no, I had think I got there like a whole day before you. Damn, I don't know. He yeah, said, Let yeah, me have the socks off. Yeah, yeah I, I was in that bit comfortable. I, bro. I, I have, bro. when I flew out to Texas this last time, my own um, got there at like ten, <clears> and I was like, bro, what the fuck I'm gonna do for five hours? So I just asked the lady, like, man, it's it's like eleven o'clock by the time I get to the hotel. I'm like, yeah. can I just check in? She was like, oh yeah, it don't matter. I'm like. I ain't, Why the fuck y'all even got that rule? I didn't even know you could like. The, I learned that it was. We keep talking about Philly. It was the one time I went to Philly. I went to Made in America by myself, and I had uh, I got a rental car, and I was like, it was like one p.m. and I was like, I went I went to sleep in the rental car, and I but I was in front of the office, and the lady like came outside, knocked on the door. She was like, Can I help you? 
And I'm like, oh, they're checking in until three. You're like, all you gotta do is come in and just ask for yeah, other check-in. Bruh, like, it don't I'm take like, them that long. To, that. It don't take them that long to clean them fucking nah, rooms. Nah, like, nah. it does not. It's no reason why they can't be like, oh nah, nah, you gotta <coughs> check in at least three. I've, I haven't had that happen to me before. Yeah, ever since then, I'm like, hell yeah, I'm I'm, I'm asking early. Yeah, That's every crazy. time I'm asking early, every fucking time. Now, I know this possible. Like, I'm asking early. If you're after <clears> like one p.m., one thirty, nine times out of ten, your room has been cleaned. Yeah. You better have been. Like nah, I'm just them, the maids yeah. when they get in there, bro. They got let's say you're in a three story um, hotel, right? Yeah, it's probably six maids. You know what I mean? They gonna tag team two to a floor type shit, and then whoever finish early gonna go down and help out. Whatever they they flip them rooms in like an hour and a half. You yeah. Imagine what they find in those rooms. Some oh, of those bro. rooms, bro. Can you imagine what they found in my room? <laughs> This last Halloween, what I, what I told you, about? I don't want to. They find a strap in there? No, nah, <laughs> not this room. But uh, you remember what I, you know, I told you? Happened on, you remember what I told you happened on me on Halloween? <laughs> not this room. I do. I <laughs> do. Yeah, it's fun. What he happened to you? Fun. He was getting fucked. Oh, whoa. <laughs> I didn't say that. Whoa, At what all. the fuck? Whoa, whoa, whoa. He was I mean, with that big burly. Unless she was on top. Woman. Yeah. Uh, 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 car- top. Carrot Top oh, was in there? Carrot Top. Car- no! <laughs> he was with Carrot Top. Look at that Carrot Top. He was with Sean White. <laughs> <laughs> nah, this one was like, this one was like Goldberg. Next time he goes to a hotel, he's going to hear a knock on the door. It's gonna be the the finger gonna be on the peak hole. Like, oh. bro, what is, what's going on? You all know me. It's the Sean White <laughs> with a hoodie on and the snowboard. Yeah. Oh no! Let me in. <laughs> <laughs> like, can I come in? No, I'm coming in anyway. <laughs> I wasn't asking. I'm coming no, in. He said, he said, "Do not disturb." He said, "Do not disturb." I can't read. That's crazy. <laughs> hey Xavier, man, you asked the wrong question, dog. I'm refer- I'm, I'm taking down any of them. Yeah, that was a good question, they say. Yeah, yeah, I'm taking out Caitlyn. All right, with some makeup on and you know, some, a bath. I think she a bath. A bath is crazy. <laughs> Jesus, <laughs> Jesus. A bath. Hey, they just gotta get rid of that ponytail. Before, before you play the last one, do you guys ever hear like they were talking about white people smell like wet dog when they're wet? German Shepherds. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Bro, what the fuck? Where the fuck did that? Because they smell like wet dog when they wet. I'm not gonna lie, bro. That threw me off when I heard that years ago. I was like. <laughs> like maybe looking myself in the mirror oh, for a second. Maybe we could have been around the wrong type like, of white people. It's, it's a couple that smell like white. Yeah, I've definitely, yeah, it's yeah, definitely yeah, been. Yeah, anybody with a MAGA hat, pretty much, basically, <laughs> probably smell like a wet German Shepherd. A yeah. wet German Shepherd. So, I'm sure you oh. see the clips where they say they don't use soap. And, yeah, you know they use mean? they don't use wash rags. Oh yeah, is yeah, that yeah, a thing or is that a myth? What white people don't use wash rags? Yes, hundred percent. White people use wash rags. I grew up using wash rags. The white people you know. Yes. I yeah, mean, I don't know. I'm not in the shower with yeah. them, actually. I'm going to be honest. I think a lot of them people, because it be used to be on pot, they just say it for, like, clickbait. I can believe that. Because there's a couple of dudes, they be like, they don't wash it later. I'm like, bro, stop it. Man. I met people oh, in yeah, real life that say they don't use but it. I, but I be seeing, like, black people say that. They were like, Whoa. I be seeing black people say they don't wash it later. I remember. I'm like, bro, you just trying to go viral. I remember yeah, I had a man, question. A uh, co worker, he was a younger guy. He was like, and we had this conversation. He's like, bro, do you, like, not to be gay or nothing, but like, when you know, when you. When you're in the shower, do you do you wash your asshole? You just let the water run down, and I'm like, yeah, it was a dude. It was a black, yeah, it was a black dude on Twitter. It was a black dude on Twitter a couple a couple of days ago. He went viral. He said it was gay to put a washcloth in your yeah, ass. Yeah, but who in the being, shower with you to even know that? Being asked that at work is insane. <laughs> Because hey, we got a safety hey, meeting on hygiene like that. Like, hey, I know we got to go out here and be safe, man. We work a dangerous yeah. ass job, my nigga. But real quick. Yeah. Your asshole clean? Is your booty clean, How you nigga? cleaning your ass? You know what I'm saying? Your booty clean, huh? You got the drip or you or the screw? Because like, if you if you let her run down your craggy ass, I mean it's gay. But if you if you get in there with a rag, it's gayer. So like, which one do you do? I'm like, bro, well, I just yeah. take a bath. Who all, in the witch you even know? Time, hey, man, all, let's not talk about my booty, man. Yeah, let's not. <laughs> yeah, I think like, you're trying to learn something new about you. Like, yeah. sir, I'm your supervisor. I don't want to tell you about what I'm doing with my booty. Yeah, only, in job, the only time you do hygiene <laughs> stuff is somebody at the job stinks. Yeah, and mm-hmm. it, 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 it just happened recently. Like, my job, we never did hygiene stuff, but with this dude, bro, he just smelled so bad. We were yeah. like, bro, we gotta. Yeah, you have to. When, smell, when it's a problem like that, you have to. Milk, you have to address man. it. You when I was to. in the military school, uh, we had a guy like that. And, uh, you know, it's community showers and that shit. So it's Sheesh. like, yeah, it's eight motherfuckers in there at a time. Sheesh. 
So niggas like kind of peep that he wasn't like using no soap. He wasn't like he wasn't doing shit. He was going standing, standing in the water. Yeah. Oh. So man, them motherfuckers. One time they waited, made sure the uh, platoon sergeant was out, and um, they gra- like paused. Gathered around this nigga, bruh, and they was like, "Yo, you gonna wash your ass, or we gonna beat your ass in the shower?" Naked was, getting beat bruh, naked is crazy, bruh. <laughs> yeah, bruh. Well, yeah. He must, well, he must rank. You know, it's yeah. that serious, yeah, dog. Like that shit, I oh. ain't never seen motherfuckers come together naked. Oh. You know, I, I say, you know how mad you gotta be to want to wanna corner somebody naked in the shower, bruh, straight up. Yeah, like so, yeah. it was stacked. like on some, pr- some prison, prison shit. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> it was like on some prison yeah. shit, dog. I was like, oh yeah, I don't get it, bro. Like. Bro, going home and washing your ass and staying in the house all day, that just feels so relaxing. Yeah. And also, I know y'all, have y'all been and been outside and y'all been sweating and you go in the shower and that water hit the sweat and that should make you feel worse yeah. until you get super, the soap off your mouth. Yeah. So I don't know how that dude would do it. It make yeah. you feel like terrible. Especially nah. y'all be out in the field and shit in the military, bro. bro. You out in the field bro. for like a while. Bro, yeah. our first I'm glad day you there. finished that because that was about to sound crazy. <laughs> you said y'all out in the field. <laughs> I'm glad you finished I mean, that. I mean, all I say, they, all I say, where this going? They, they, they corner, they corner <laughs> motherfuckers oh in the shower. Yeah. You gotta, you gotta be real specific. Yeah. <laughs> That's crazy. Oh, they trying oh. to say I'm not part of the culture, man. Jesus yeah, Christ, yeah, bro. Yeah, having, having several people group around me and tell me they're gonna beat my ass while I'm naked is like, yeah. dog. Our first terrifying. day there, we did two miles. Like that, we got Damn. off a bus. <laughs> you gotta do up downs. <laughs> With your bag, like, what are remember, y'all even remember training for? Titans, nigga? It's a War. military school, like nigga. <laughs> military that's real shit. That's that's what it was like. Yeah, remember the Titans for, for six months. You know what I'm saying? Six like, months is bro. crazy. So, um, yeah. <clears throat> needless to say, your ass was like stanky, yeah, homie. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah your uh, booty, nigga. homie. I would be like, bro, I'm just gonna join ISIS. I know they ain't trying <laughs> to like that. Hell no, nah, I couldn't imagine my tallest being in the military, bro. They put me up front and kill me real quick. I don't even prepare for that shit. They gonna use you as a shield, right? Get in front. <laughs> you better get good with electronics or something. Yeah, right. Stay in base. Go, go straight medical. Don't even fight. 100%. Fucking, don't even fight. Nah, they be putting medical niggas on the. Uh, you ain't seen Private Ryan? No. They killed the medic. They did. The, the medics medic. be riding around trying to uh, heal mm-hmm. everybody up. Damn, no, yeah. just don't ride around. They got to keep a medic. You only, only be like that when you leave the base. Bro, I'm 6'5. They're going to see my ass like, real quick. <laughs> Fuck. Damn. <laughs> real shit. Real shit. Oh yeah, Connor. Also, man, you gotta stop taking pictures that were standing next to people. Yeah, bro, straight up, man. Yeah, stop, I ain't like that. It's not helping your case at all, bro. That's my favorite shit to do because co- people commenting bro, on it all bro, the they, time. Bro, they tore me up in the comments, bro. <laughs> they did get <laughs> you know, like, they making folks look like little. I was like, 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 I'm short, but I ain't that short. But he <laughs> made me look crazy, bro. Your, y'all's followers got on his ass, bro. It was fucked up. <laughs> I they was like, I ain't, they like, I ain't know Hemp was five one. I was like, bro, I'm not five fucking one, man. This motherfucker. Just tall. Yeah. <laughs> no, that I do that on purpose crazy. now because so many people have commented on it. <laughs> it's, it's my favorite shit. Because uh, I think there's only one person I've had on the podcast that's been anywhere near my height. I'm gonna start keeping a milk crate. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Just stand on it for decoration. Uh-huh. Yeah. It, it's, some, it, it's somebody that's gonna be on your show. I ain't gonna put my brother out, man, but he insecure about his height. It'll be sometime when he be taking pictures, he be standing on his tippy toes. Nah, that's crazy. When you you gonna see it when you take that picture, bro, man. His, I ain't gonna call him out, bro. But I think I know you talking about. <laughs> <laughs> Let me know after. I'll get him on nah, the pod. I'm like, hey, bro, we gotta take a picture before we start right. this. I'm just gonna look to the right. <laughs> I definitely seen a few people doing that before. Right. <laughs> <Ain't> that- <laughs> No, no, not Joe. I'm trying to look to the right. Boy, I was like, Joe been on the show already. I'm talking I'm about like, not yeah. Joe. Yeah, where well, we know you crash out. Look, to, look to the far. I, I don't think we took a photo like that, Joe. We, we did, did the same photo. We did the same photo. I was like, yeah, let's sit on the couch. Yeah. <laughs> when I got you on the pod, I, I got you. <laughs> yeah. I'm talking about look to the far right off camera. <laughs> if you get my get my drift. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> all right, last last voicemail. This one from Chloe Hotline. All right, all right. This is Chloe Hotline. Why? What it is? I fucked up on the last one, but I finally got my question together. All right, I should play the fucked so, up one. <laughs> have you <laughs> ever had anybody get the wrong idea about your sexuality? Now I know that's a crazy question, but yeah, it is. here's a story. So <laughs> I'm catching a flight home from Thames, Orlando, or something. First mistake. And me. I don't like men. I don't. I really don't. But the male flight attendant over there gives me googly eyes and shit, give me extra snacks and shit. I'm like, damn, I might, extra I might try to finesse this. But yeah, 
Has that ever happened, or have you ever got hit on by somebody or some per, some whoever, and you didn't swing that way? Just a just a general general question. Peace and love, y'all been killing it, and I'm probably gonna leave another question next week. Appreciate that, Claire. For sure. Uh, you remember that time you went to Subway? <laughs> yeah, I was about to bring that up. <laughs> Real quick, Chloe. I mean, to the to the flight attendant's defense, you do most flight, atten- most gonna- most flight attendants are males. For what I just asked you. Yeah, what were you gonna say? Though? I don't <laughs> think he was gonna say that. What were you gonna say? Because he, he might be thinking, say, uh, I'm thinking. What were you gonna say? <laughs> she do be wearing, you know. Yeah. She yeah, could get her goog- They would get her googly eye. I'm right. guessing. Yeah. So, but he, but he did, but you wouldn't know that that he, that she, likes, from, what they post. Yeah. So maybe he That's thought gotta like talk to people. Hey, she's on the that. spectrum. Fuck all that shit. I just got no free snacks. I like. I want three more. What's that? Bischoff oh, cookies. Oh, nigga, I definitely yeah. 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 cookies be Boy, hard. Bischoff cookies right. be good. Yeah. 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 How yeah. many seasons in first right. in first class? Oh, yeah. and, and, and fucking um <laughs> the uh, waffle shits. That uh, Delta, Delta, the waffle cookies that Delta be having? I ain't had those. I don't think. Oh, I just had a, the yeah. Bishaw ones. I'd be like, bro, I'd be up. Bishaw ones hard. Hey, What's no, each other waffle them, shits? Them, them nuts? Hey. The peanuts? I don't really eat peanuts like that. Nah. I already do a fire. I don't eat Extra peanuts snacks like that. Extra snacks is crazy. Them, 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 them go crazy. Are they salty or are they sweet? Yes. They they perfect, <laughs> bro. Yes. They that's, perfect. That's that, that did not answer my question. Nah, that's 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 pretty accurate. What more do you need? What more convincing do you need, bro? They the best. They nah, perfect. I'm they wrong. legit the best peanuts you'll ever have. Yeah. 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 Speaking of yeah, speaking of what Devin talking about Subway, man, I got one story, bro. <laughs> it, was a, it was a gay dude in Subway making my sandwich, and it just it was just us in there. So this one I work in a radio shack. <laughs> So, bro, just like extra flamboyantly gay. I'm like, I don't give a fuck, bro. Make my sandwich. Yeah. So, he making my sandwich, bro. He making like all kind of eye contact with me. Yeah. And I'm like, I'm like, dog, focus on my sandwich, bro. Like, <laughs> I think it was like this. Yeah, he's making my sandwich <laughs> like that. <laughs> so, bro, no lie, bro. I ain't even making this up, bro. Bro, start licking, bro start licking his lips. Oh. I thought you was about to start saying licking the bread. I was going to say. <laughs> Oh, I would've. He wanted you. <laughs> he just, I would've. He took a turn off the line. <laughs> nah, bro. He would've been on the line. I would've left. Like, I would've just left. I ain't paid for you. Both hands on the counter, nigga. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Talking about a wet sandwich, bro. <laughs> what kind of it you want? So, <laughs> so, bro, he like, he look at me, dog. He just looking me in the eyes, bro. He was like, you want more meat? All right. <laughs> I'm like, what? I'm like, bro, what's going on? You should have said, is it, is, is it? <laughs> nah, nah, that's nah, crazy. Nah, hold <laughs> nah, hold up. I was working with this dude, and dude name was Kelvin, and we used to, like, joke around all the time. <laughs> and we was frequent that Subway because it was, like, the only thing next to the radio tag. So we ate at the Subway all the time. Yeah. I said, Kelvin put you up to this? <laughs> <laughs> No, like Kelvin put you up to this. He, he looked at me. He said, "I don't know Kelvin." Oh my oh. god! But I know Anthony. Yeah. <laughs> How you know my name, nigga? It got your on your name too. So he was like, he was like, I was like, nah, I was like, bro, make my sandwich, man. He was like, you sure you don't want no more meat? I was like, man, no. <laughs> it's like even an option. I've never been a sub where they asked you wanted more meat. Like, you got to ask yeah, them. Yeah, you got to tell them. Nah, that's crazy. Unless he was nah. trying to give me the meat for free, that's... Yeah, 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 he was trying to give you the meat for free, my boy. He was... That's crazy, bro. I was like, nigga I'll, said the meat on me today. I was like, bro, I don't want. I was like, whatever meat advertised, that's the meat I want, bro. I want Bruh. more meat. This is an Arby's, bro, where they have the meat. Right, like, like, they even have. All right, nigga, I want ham. Like, <laughs> matter of fact, matter of fact, fact, give me one of the vegetarian subs. I don't even want no meat. Just take that, all this shit off. Oh, man. Uh, bro, I'm pescatarian. <laughs> 
fucked up, <laughs> funny as fuck. Nigga look you in your eyes, bro. Uh, you, know, like, you want first, some on me? Right when it happened, I, I called Devin. I was like, bro, this is what happened. You sure? Bro, I bust out laughing on the phone on his man face, That's bro. That was funny. so hilarious. I'm like, I gotta tell somebody, bro. This like, <laughs> I feel violated right now. <laughs> I, was, I was in the back. I was on my lunch break because I, I was in the back of subway with this foot long sub, and I'm like, bro, I just feel violated. Oh, nigga, yeah, bro. you don't know, <laughs> <laughs> we wanted to give you That's back when it was $5 for I thought, long. It was yeah, two for, more, boy. Yeah, man. Yeah, yeah. Bro, we was cool with them subway people. We used to go there with like no money. We were like, bro, put this on our credit, bro. Yeah. <laughs> That's real. Y'all, you reason Radio Shack went out of business, nigga. About on them fucking sandwiches. <laughs> <laughs> That's why they went out of business. Company, 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 and all. company started <laughs> covering them. Yeah. <laughs> Damn. Why we got $13,000 in subway <laughs> costs here? What the fuck? We just got these Bluetooths. Yeah. Why are they paying for subway? <laughs> Subway, you imagine working your full shift, bro, and you come back and some dude try to sexually assault your ass in the subway? Yeah, bro. <laughs> yeah, bro. I can't imagine. I'm like, nah, bro. bro he looked at me, bro. He said, you want some more meat, bro. Before you already licking his lips. <laughs> Oh, like, man, I was like, man, I'm trying to, like, I ain't trying to crash out on dude, but I was like, bro, chill out a little bit, bro. Like, turn it down a little bit, bro. All right, if you... Right, <laughs> turn, like, turn, down just, turn out the gate. Like, no, I know I'm, ha- I know I'm handsome, bro. If you attracted to me, that's, that's I know cool. you want me, but... Yeah, that's cool, bro, but turn it down a notch, bro. If that's you were just to hit on me a little bit, like, oh, whatever, bro. Just don't put your hands on me. But if bro said more meat, I was like, I was like bro, just finish. Hey, please finish my sandwich. That's crazy. Um... I gotta And he made me pay for it. it. He made me pay for it too. I got a gill one in that. Hold on. Let me get mine out of the way. Go ahead and get your mine ain't even mine mild. Um, gay niggas do fuck with you. Bro, chill out now. (laughs) Chill out now. That's crazy. (laughs) Just say it. Just say it. That is crazy. You the fan favorite. Just say it. Let me check the polls, bro. You the you fan favorite. Go ahead, dude. Um, I was at a, a Wolves and football <laughs> yeah. game one time, and um, as we was walking out, it was two of them and one. Two of what? The gay niggas. Oh. And then <laughs> uh, a woman in the middle. And uh, These GNs out here crazy, bro. Especially if they YGNs. G- well, you don't want them. <laughs> You don't want them to watch the ends? Yeah. Run. They, they, they worse than the crash out. The young, the, the, the young gay niggas? Yeah, they got run. switches. They and, gay and, and, and they, they got switches. They got switches and they switching. Yeah. They, got, they got switches and they switching. <laughs> You'll be all mixed up. <laughs> um, as we were walking out of the, out of the, like, I mean, field, I don't know what you call them shits now. Like, it ain't a, a stadium type shit, but. Uh, so we walking out the gates, field. you know what yeah. I'm saying? Yeah, as we walking out the gates and shit, uh, <laughs> you could tell that they were like talking about people passing. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. And he looked me square in my face, like you know how you just glance over <laughs> and you see someone that is looking at you so <laughs> intently, caught you right in the eyes, like yeah, yeah that you have to look like. Like, yeah. damn, why are you second looking one? at me? You yeah. know what I'm saying? That nigga said, Oh, girl, he cute. Oh, damn. And loud as You should have blushed. <laughs> yeah, hell yeah. <laughs> what, what that would have hurt? <laughs> I should have blushed. The crazy. same thing that would have hurt you, bro. If you would have took that meat. That's the meat. the fuck up. <laughs> and oh, shut up. Oh, you. <laughs> Shut up, man. <laughs> it's not the same. <laughs> You're finished with your story. It's not the same now. <laughs> what you said two episodes ago? Not so fun when the rabbits got the gun. <laughs> <laughs> man, when that nigga said that, I tried to play it like ain't nobody here. I'm probably in a group of like five niggas. Oh no, bro! And my little brother was with me. <laughs> you heard him, Joe? <laughs> hey, as soon as we got out the gate, everybody's still talking and shit. I'm the only one quiet, and he the only one looking at me. He said, "Man, I heard what he said to you." <laughs> <laughs> he called you cute. Oh my god! I was like, hey man, we not gonna talk about this no more. Yeah. <laughs> this here. Right, right here, yeah, right here. Put it in this box. You know what I'm saying? 
Y'all got some experiences, bro. I never, never yeah, had this. Nah. You, know, you six five. It's coming soon. If it ain't having already, it's just fuck coming soon. Goddamn. Saying, as long as someone's trying to offer me extra meat on my sandwich and shit, <laughs> just hope that's you. Pretty god, that's so all they right. yeah, right. got. Right. Wrong. <laughs> but uh, Devin said he got a gay one. So uh, let's hear it. I'm not making this up at all. Remember when we lived together? Uh, what 2011, 2012? Bro, clear this up, bro. No, 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 no. This, this is happening. I was on we were, we was roommates. <laughs> yeah, and not the Bert and Ernie way. Niggas did. You know, remember when we lived together? Yeah. It's so gay. Yeah. Remember when we lived together? Yeah. I, didn't, I didn't say it like that. Yeah, you did. I didn't put this on like, it. Bro, I didn't put this on it. God damn it. Hey, bro. You yeah. were anyway, close. Remember, I used to, I used to travel. I used to drive home from work, right? Yeah. Okay. One time. I happened to stop in uh, Clarksville, Tennessee at like 8 o'clock at night. And uh, I had to get some gas. Okay, so I'm stopping at the gas station. All of a sudden, this 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 this, this husky fella comes up to me. And he, uh, I, told, I told you about this story. I think you probably know what I'm talking about. But he come up to me and was like, hey, uh, do you have $2 I can borrow? I'm like, uh, yeah, bro, I got some change. I don't really care like that. So I gave I gave him two dollars, and I thought that was the end of this whole altercation or whatever this is. It wasn't. Um, <clears throat> he was like, "Okay, so like, uh, you got three dollars?" I'm like, "Why? Why did you ask me for two if you needed three? He's like, "Well, because um, I just wanted to know, like, do you do you do you?" <laughs> He's like, do you do you mess around with fellas or like that? Because I could I could I could we could go behind this BP and uh, I get, I'm like, whoa 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 you what? For three dollars, he was like, "Nah, nah, nah." I was, I was just gonna get, I was gonna suck your dick for three hours. Whoa, whoa, whoa. That's what I said, nigga. I had, you know how you how you pay for your shit in the in the gas station and you 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 had your your, your shit in your in your in your car. I ain't gonna front, Devin. I would have been on the news that day, bro. bro no, I, had, I, had, I had already paid for my gas, and um, you know I have, you know how you put the you put the pump in your car, you go in the paint and you just pump gas. <laughs> nigga, I took my shit out and I just drove off. I had already paid for the gas and everything. That's not even the worst part about this. I it drove. Work. It's not, bro, bro. Check this out. <laughs> check this out. I drove. I'm, was he I'm, in the car? No, 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 no. <laughs> no, at least, no. At least you sure? Hey, at least at least. <laughs> 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 I got in my car. Licking his lips. No, bro, <laughs> bro that would be great. Bro, I, I, my nigga, when I'm driving off to get back on the interstate, I'm like, I'm just get gas in the next goddamn city. If I run out of gas, I run out of gas, bro. Fuck it. As I'm driving off, I kid you not, on my son. This man is in the parking lot twerking. <laughs> this man is in the parking lot at BP throwing ass. It's like eight o'clock in the, and I'm just like I'm driving like what? for three dollars. Bro, that's crazy. Bro, he came out of nowhere. Bro, it was like a big nigga. Like uh, you know who remind me of Spice Adams. That's what he looked like. Nah, nah, he was like nah, fucking, nah. I swear to God, he that's like crazy. a big gay Spice Adams. You remember all three strikes when um uh, bro was in the hospital after he got yeah. shot in the ass? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Yeah, that's what it that reminded me of, bro. And I drove. This man was twerking in the parking lot of the BP, bro. Nah, you know what those people are called, bro? That's called lot lizards. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You that's watch, what he was. Yeah, watch out on the lot at lizards. At a BP gas station yeah, in the BP middle of the goddamn mountains. I don't know, know if we can out. use the same term for what we call the women. You know? Yeah, yeah. I, 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 I ain't never seen a man lot lizard. I, I, nah, it's a lot gator. Yeah, lot gator. But that, that was the time I had nothing to top that, bro. After that, I was like, bro, why is this man? I ain't gonna hold for you. Three dollars, bro. That's crazy. I'm like, bro, your prices ain't even. That's crazy. Your prices. Re- like, I why seen a truck driver on Instagram. He was parked, and this guy <clears throat> just walked up on him, and he was like, "Hey, how you doing?" <laughs> and the guy's recording. He's like, "I'm all right, man. What's going on?" He said. Oh, nothing. And he started looking at the truck like he was going to say something about the truck. Yeah. That nigga said, well, I mean, do you want to get your dick sucked? See? Whoa. See, it does I was happen. like, what it does the happen. fuck? What the fuck? <laughs> Bruh, if we, if I might, we have, might do it like that. That scared me from ever wearing the CDL. We, <laughs> we, might so do, we might do it on a Patreon one day. I used to, my, of course, my dad drove trucks. I used to go ride with him during the summer. <laughs> bro, I got so many insane stories. Yeah, like, you, you, you seen some crazy shit. I believe I remember it. one time my dad went inside the, uh, he went inside to get us food and whatnot. Yo, we had the fuel pumps, bruh. This, this dude, he just pull up, bruh. He just rolled down his window and he just threw some draws down between where my <laughs> our truck and his. Bro, look down, bruh. The dude, the draw covered in doo doo, bro. Oh! He, just, oh. <coughs> he just threw, he just threw him, bruh. 
I remember one time I'm riding with nah, my dad. Is. My dad don't curse at all, bro. He don't. You gotta like. He don't curse ever, bro. Yeah. So I remember one, I, I'm asleep, bro. I just hear my dad cursing on the on the speed last week. And then dude, he like he like, yeah, man, I'm about to throw this cup of piss at your truck. My dad was like, man, you throw this fucking piss at my truck. And he like, I got my son in the truck. I'm gonna beat your fucking ass in front of my son. Why? I was like, bro, what's going what on? What started? What led to that? Like, bro, I don't they know. They was talking shit for hours. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Me, like, bro. yeah when they be on that radio, they be yeah, talking, radio. bro. They be roasting. I used, to, I used to see my dad on the radio all the time talking shit. I'm like, bro, I don't even know this. I don't legal. know. Escalator, bro, said he had a cup of piss, bro. You gonna throw it on the truck? Hey man, the truck yeah. driver be having cups, cups of, of piss. piss yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I remember one time when I went on my <laughs> road with my dad. I seen a bunch of cups in the back. I was like, bro, what's going on? Yeah, bro? Gatorade bottles and shit, don't trust. Yeah, you see the Gatorade? I was like, man, it's, 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 no, it is normal, bro. Like, yeah, that's nasty. Yeah, especially when they went up to get it, they got to. Uh, yeah, you got to. You guys crazy. Like, you got to be across the other city yeah, like bro. two days. Yeah, yeah bro, you got to piss in that piss cup. Piss in them fucking bottles, bro. Yeah, that's crazy. My man. dad got a piss cooler, bro. He just emptied it. Nah, 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 cooler, nah, nah, nah. You know how you drain that shit? That's crazy. I know it. I know it, trust. Thank you. Can't smell that in the. um. Start That's why you gotta put piss, it in the cooler. It's cooler, bro. Three day old piss put, in there, bro. Put ice on it. You good? Uh, put ice it's on it. You good, bro. That's bro. I know y'all. I, didn't tell them to have I know y'all done been driving by a truck and you see them pour something. That's that yeah, piss. That's that mm-hmm. piss. Definitely. And it, hit, your, and it hit your car. My nigga, if you, if, you, if, you, if you buy a truck and you driving on the highway like in another state and they, yeah, keep your windows up. Lean this and say, just keep your windows up. <laughs> yeah, that ever happened to me. I'm gonna, I'm gonna air that motherfucking shit out, man. <laughs> Shoot them tires and that nigga um, going down. I don't know if I right. have to. So <laughs> it was my it, one of my dad homies, man. He said one of he was driving trucks, and he said he was eating at the KFC buffet with bro. And after they left, bro had a heart attack and like crashed the truck. Oh shit! And I was like, bro, what the fuck was in that chicken, bro? Believe it or not, that like, does that happen had, too. Truck drivers have heart attacks all the time. They so unhealthy because all they like, do is eat and drive. You yeah. just sit all day, bro. Yeah, yeah. Like, bro had some <clears throat> deadly chicken, bro. That's crazy. And the KFC buffet is crazy. That nigga nah. cleared them out. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, them KFC buffets are good as shit. Yeah, yeah, no, like, I don't even fuck with buffets no more. What, bro? Yeah, after, after the pandemic, nah. Nah, shit. Before the pandemic, nigga, I was not. Texas. 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 Oh, yeah. Last yeah, time Texas, I Texas, fucked Texas, with the buffet. They had a fucked up buffet in Texas? Nah, the buffet no. was great. Yeah, my experience. <laughs> the <laughs> atmosphere was it. His experience was it. Oh, shit, I had fun. I don't know. That nigga talking about eat my compound chicken. People treat you like shit? No, these yes. two. Yes. Him and my cousin, the pranksters. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, we trying to get I, PTSD. I had this shit <laughs> bad as fuck, bro. And so... Cause we had to drive him to uh, San, Antonio. San Antonio, yeah. So we were in Austin. We drove him to San Antonio, and then we stopped, bro. It's like a big ass nigga. It was the biggest buffet out there. It was seen. nothing else around that buffet. It was just in the Dumb. middle of nowhere. It was like off the highway. Yeah. You could see like you're driving down the highway, <laughs> and there's just this big ass megaplex, well lit buffet. buffet. <laughs> Bro, so every one of us was all like, yeah, we got to stop it. We was hungry as fuck, though. No, we were definitely, we had that smoking nonstop. Yeah. So, <clears throat> as soon as we get in, we grab the table. And I mean, dog, <clears throat> I didn't even sit down. I was like, yo, the waiter comes. I said, give me a sweet tea. No, I think I told y'all to order me a sweet tea. We definitely did for you. And I was like. I'm gonna go to the bathroom. I got a shit before I eat. You know what I mean? I had the shit. Bad, shit at a buffet dog. is wild. Bro, I had the shit so <laughs> bad. I get in there, the bathroom is full, nigga. Oh, full. that's the worst. The crazy part is, there's only one stall open and it's perfect, like, for me to just go in and shit. Yeah. So I go in, like, and I mean, when I say it's full, everybody's, like, facing the urinal, in the stall, whatever, right? So I walk in smooth. Mm. Bro, I start shitting. <laughs> I, I mean, I'm, I'm, like, in my flow now. And a cup appears, like, this is the uh, the the bottom of the stall. Yeah. My cousin just hands... <laughs> <laughs> the cup under the stall. Here you go. Here go your sweet tea, Joe. This is what you ordered, right? I can hear everyone in the bathroom just stop. Like, bro, water stopping, blowing. Everyone just looking back at the stall. And I mean, I'm shitting, bro. It stinks. You know what I mean? Like, 
<laughs> Nigga, they just those bamber spray Bro. shit. You got dehydrated. I'm like, what the fuck, man? I come out mad as hell, but it was funny. I ain't gonna lie, it, I was laughing my ass off. <laughs> But bro, like, yeah, they ruined my experience. I, uh, and your cousin, I and your cousin defense, I dare him to do it, even though he was grown ass. Nah, I got, I say, man, <laughs> give me a new motherfucking drink right now, <laughs> nigga. Like, what the? Fuck, that nigga was bro. like, the dude, was like, I remember when that shit came to the table. He was like, yeah, Joe drank here. What do we do? I'm like, well, we can either let Just it leave sit. it there, man. I was like, nah, nah, this was the I was like, children. I was like, Mike, you can let that shit sit, or you go give it to him in the bathroom so he ain't got to wait. Only bro, Devin, <laughs> the only Devin and Mike could do this. <laughs> See that. That's why I didn't ask Devin. See, bro, you're brave to do that, bro. I have, bro. I have buddies who I've known for 20 I years. He, I wouldn't let them sit anywhere near my fucking bro. Drink, bro. I didn't bro. think he bro. was going to do ass. it. When we I were in high school, do I asked Devin to re- We went to McDonald's. He was getting up for a refill. It's just us three. I say, bro, you grab my refill. That nigga said, yeah. I took my straw out. And I mean, like, I'm sitting there twirling my straw type shit. Yeah. He comes around the corner and he says, I hope you don't mind, but I put your straw in for you. I was like, what in the fuck? I looked at him. I was like, bro, this is your friend. I put put straws in all my niggas' drinks at the time. Shut up, man. (laughs) You ain't put no straw in my drink. Twice, actually. He didn't know. What in the hell? He just didn't know. Nah, bro. That's just what that's my thing. <laughs> you, did you go get another straw though? Well, at least they ain't put a straw. Bro, in I had drink. my straw. <laughs> at least they ain't put a straw in your drink and blow bubbles. Like, oh, yeah, oh. yeah, see, I ain't do that. I make the jacuzzi shit. Man. <laughs> nah, taking it to the bathroom is definitely. Yeah, that was crazy, that's, bro. You got all kind of doo doo particles. Bro, bro, this bro. was before COVID. Especially bro. here. <laughs> nah. <laughs> what you about to say? Thank you. This is quitting my thirst. Bro, like, nah. <laughs> he walked out with the cup. No, I didn't, bro. <laughs> that, that nigga had to come. I couldn't believe that shit. I'm, and mind you, I'm in a public fucking restaurant. Yeah. I'm not sitting I on the toilet. I ain't gonna fuck. I ain't gonna fuck. Ain't even doing one of these. Bro, and I'm laughing. <laughs> Hold on to the rail and shit. I'm in that bit like this, bro. <laughs> <laughs> like, <laughs> legit trying not to like. <laughs> you know how you turtle head just shit? It's like, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I'm like, bro, I'm dying laughing. Like, bro, get the fuck out of the bathroom, man. What the fuck? I ain't gonna front. Right? I remember one time, man, I was like, it was a hot ass bathroom when I was taking a shit. And I was like, I, I would have took that sweet tea. <laughs> Bro, it was hot. It was hot as fuck. Bro. I would actually enjoy that. I wish somebody that brought me a sweet. That's crazy. I'm like, damn. I wish Joe cousin was here. <laughs> I really need a sweet tea. Bro, that shit in his bathroom. You ever have those shits where you gotta like take your clothes off and shit, bro? It's like it's oh, so yeah. bad. Yeah. Like, like yeah. you're sitting there like sweating your ass off, bro. Oh yeah. Not yet, bro. Man, I feel like I'm getting close to that. Talk about like bubble that's guts, the best, bro. That's the best one. I know. You feel like a person afterwards. Stomach yeah. issues. So yeah, I don't definitely had them. You gotta take your socks off Everything Nigga you still be in that bitch sweating It's like Be questioning the Lord like why would you do this to me Why Lord get me through this (laughs) Cut on the cold water shower Let everybody know yo the bathroom off limits God damn Yo that shit's done Melting the toilet with that shit man man. man. That shit did all right, man. We're going to wrap it up, man. This is <laughs> this is a this was a classic, man. I love this episode. episode. This was a Definitely. good one, man. Hell yeah, man. I appreciate you guys letting me come on. Yes, sir. I appreciate you coming. Uh, honor, man. Go ahead and plug everything. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. So if you guys want to check out more about me, uh, say we have some wild stories on there. Not maybe not quite as wild like this. <laughs> <laughs> We're talking about no lot lizards, you know, coming at us or anything like that. Lot gators. Lot gators. That actually might be the name of the episode. That's a good one. But uh, make sure you guys come check us out. It's going to be the Who Are You podcast. You guys can find us on all social media platforms. Uh, yeah. If you guys are going to try to find us on YouTube, it's going to be Who Are You question mark podcast. We have everybody from you know uh, athletes on there, artists, musicians, really a mix of people. Even had Amp, even had Joe on, and yeah. now we got to get Devin on. Gotta Don't get, the get me on that, Why, bro? bro? You, you know, if you love your show. Well, yeah. good old time, man. We'll make sure yeah. I take that tall picture with it. You know what I mean? Make sure you have oh, that man, on. Don't do that to me. Yeah. Get a crate. <laughs> but make sure you guys you come got, check us get out. Get an EBL in time. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, we post our episodes every single Monday at 5 a.m. Yeah. We haven't missed one and going on three years. So make sure you guys check us out. And like I said, guys, appreciate y'all's time today. Tap I had a good time. Tap in, tap Thank in, you, man. Show. Matter of fact, we got your yeah. sticker on the fridge. I saw bro. that yeah, earlier. Yeah, yeah. I fucked with it, man. Yeah, man. Who are you? Who are you?
And we are AOP. That's who we is. Mm. Hey, man, it's been another episode of Green R. Green Man. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. It worked that time. Last hey, time we was having a little bit of technical difficulties. We're going to get up out of here before it get hit again, man. This has <laughs> been another episode of Random Master Podcast. With all that said, we out. Yes, sir.